Oh, but Joey. Like we said, finishing the bounty. The, finishing the bounty. I, I miss. I misspoke hey. earlier. The bounty wasn't wasn't cleared until Joey picked this. So now all three bounties are cleared. Nice For job. the people. Now he's gonna play Fang the rest of the turn. <laughs> I mean, he might just be able to beat Rip with, with the Marduk, you know. I do know <laughs> Rip has had some legendary sets against some legendary Marduk players in the past. Jefferson. Oh, thanks, man. <laughs> no, not Jefferson. Jefferson's brother. Oh, okay. I always get that mixed up. Yeah, Jefferson played Miguel. No, Jefferson played Nina. His brother's name was Miguel. <laughs> and, he, and Miguel played Marduk. <laughs> oh! <laughs> Steve the Paul player. Oh, I'm so confused. <laughs> <laughs> Doug from Paris. Yeah. <laughs> oh, oh my God, God. Dragon yeah. Hammer. Dude, and you know what's the funniest way? Miguel, the best way that he always beat Rip was throwing him out of the air while Rip's doing fake flip or real yeah. flip kick. Rip I mean, likes the, to take the disguise. I mean, the the one, the, the sickest one was when Rip did Legend Kick and, and Miguel was like, mm, grabbed it right out of there. <laughs> oh, nice. Ooh. Oh, didn't get the unscaled, though. Yeah, you didn't get the unscaled. Oh, still got the tackle, though. Nice. That's great, though. That's clutch. I mean, kind of. Oh, oh, that's a big bet against Marlo. He's going to be able to launch that easy every yep. time. Round three. Fight. I should block it some more. Ooh, big low. Again. Oh, Python explosion. Oh! Into the forward one plus four. I love that move. I love that move. Oh, oh. God. Tackle these nuts. What? No, the double. It was, but it didn't even look like he pressed anything, but yeah, he still The very it. last second he pressed yeah. one. He, he, he must, have, must have swung. All right, going to get a little ball combo. The power crush. No, oh, just short. Yeah, too, too far away from the wall. Wow! Oh, best rage drive in the game. Wow, that rage drive sucks. <laughs> if he was... <laughs> yeah, that rage drive is one of those, right? It's like, wow, he, that rage drive sucks. It's just like, he I'm was, a genius. Oh, oh no! He, he was too close to the wall for it to be like a combo. You need to be yeah. further from the wall, but not too far from the wall because then it does a wall splat. Oh, God. <laughs> No, too many hits, Rip. Rip, <laughs> keep track of your hits on the wall. Oh my God, this is getting crazy. Tackle, oh, good break then. Look, he broke that early too. Whoa. Oh no. Oh no, no break on the throw either. <laughs> Dude, he yeah. threw him up to the up. Oh my God, Joey having I saw the ceiling of the stage. Yeah, he threw him up <laughs> way up there, dude. <laughs> Oh no. Oh, no. Throw? No, flip him over. Oh no, God, it's time. a one throw, Rip. It's a one throw. <laughs> Oh. It's a mix up, bro. The one throw does more damage. Two can slam it while dead either way. Guess. Uh, wow, I've never even seen the. Well, the one's the launcher. There's a, so there's a little those... G Corp thing up there. Damn, look at that. Yeah. We claimed both MYKs. <laughs> <laughs> we, we captured and arrested both MYKs. Damn. NYK and armored NYK, we got them. And yeah, we got the king bounties as well. Good stuff, people. Don't forget to follow them over on Astro TR, over on the Twitterverse to get a chance to win some of these Astro gaming products. Yeah, you know, all these bounties are done across all three tournaments. So the Asia region, Europe region, and then we always got to finish it out here in the NA because, you know, we sometimes that's how it be. You know, we just got to do really? all the work over here. It feels like we're janitors of the Astro Bounty or something. I mean, we just like, come in and sweep the, them up, you know. We just the Tekken, the Tekken in NA can be kind of messy sometimes. So <laughs> yeah. yeah, we got to clean it up a little bit. Oh man! <laughs> All right, but good game one there from both Joey and Rip. Uh, I mean, Joey, you know, I think I was kind of hoping, honestly, to see the Fang. I wanted to see how you would play this matchup against Rip, but the uh, Marduk is a uh, buff. Marduk's always buff, man, and it's. The fact that, you know, we already knew that when Joey called him Craig, it was like a rap. You know, that's his main. But, oh, man, I, that was rough, though. What what, what could Rip do? Oh, uh, man. Um, it's not even just one thing. It's yeah, like... that wall setting, too, is so risky against Marduk, right? Because the launch punish is so easy for him. So, I don't know. Pick us maybe safer mid if he's going for the big payout. But that's why he's going for it. Maybe flip kick instead of... I don't know. He's got to try. Like he's just he's, honestly the way you're supposed to. You're supposed to beat Marta. Quote uh, finger quotes. Is that you're supposed to bully him, smother him. Like just do a lot of like quick jabs, keep him in check. Don't let him do anything. Try to counter hit him. But 
You know, that's like saying don't get counter hit by Brian. Like, don't be afraid of getting counter hit by Brian. It's like when Marnik's in your face doing stuff, he's scary. Uh -huh. There we go. <laughs> yeah, well, the hop kick was, was a great equalizer in some cases here. Gonna get the wall carry too. Big damage. Ooh. I mean, what is a big character? I wonder if he can rip can get some better uh, wall combos after that. But oh, oh boy, not even gonna matter. Good the slash kick. Fight. Whoa! Punish that. Everybody's it's still getting punished for right? That's twelve. It's twelve now. Oh, oh man, all right. So now Rip's answer is to just launch him while he does every mid or every low. Ooh, no, 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 no. <laughs> oh. Nope. Messed up slide. Rip with the lead, just going for the kill. Banana peel. Mm -hmm. Two rounds. Looking Fun. good. Fat headbutt. Whack oh jump. My what God. Was that? Joey just looked at it too. No reaction. So we <laughs> punished that at all. He's like, what is he doing? He's like, huh, okay, we're doing that now, huh? Okay. Maybe he thought it was gonna be like a jump jumping empty jump into like down three four or something. Oh right. the hop hop kick. kick. Oh, oh, oh. oh he got away because of the wall angle. Oh, why did you spring kick? Ooh yeah, that oh. spring kick. Joey was ready for it. Does the pick up there to get the combo? Nice job. That's something you always gotta be wary of too, right? When you do certain spring yeah. kicks like that, oh and these hop kicks now getting too predictable. Maybe not though. Maybe Rip should just keep throwing them out and hopefully they'll all hit. Ooh, but, the big count. You know, like what Bloodhawk said, like if he just kept them locked down with a couple of jabs and just yeah, kept do the some dragon up, hammers, some jabs. And Law's toolkit seems like it's built perfectly for that type of style against Varda. Oh no! Rip Side got... wall might come into play to save him. No, it's not. Oh, it actually hooked him up. It actually hooked him up some more. Yeah, he gets a better it. follow up because of that how was. Cool yeah, that was nice. That's, That's so much so better too. Because yeah, you get Why the. Why does he get an unscaled at the end of the freaking one plus two throw? I don't know. Blame the Marduk <laughs> nerds that figured it out. Seventy-seven damage. Oh, the the switch up. Get in trouble. Wow! Oh! <laughs> rip doing rip things. Look, he's doing the easier combos. Okay. Oh, if he just did the other staple, though, I think he would have got the wall. Nice duck. Oh, but in the wall splat. Oh, getting. Uh, what is? Oh, oh, no! Oh my God! He really just threw that out. I mean, fourteen, right? Oh, which the one? second one's fourteen, or which it? A back one two one, on two? Marta. I mean, I would have just done yeah, lost. He could have done one two. two right? He could have definitely won two. Yeah, he could have definitely lost a one two, but he got a slide Breaking. instead. Damn. Oh, oh Mac. Con. Oh. Mac beating oh, him two times, double jeopardy. He's gonna move on into loser side top eight. Nice job to Mac taking the spot in top eight. Conflict going out in ninth place. You know, the conflict last week was the one that eliminated Cuddlecore two like twice like that. So he got a little taste of his own medicine there, losing to the same person twice in one tournament. That I gotta, sucks. I gotta <laughs> massage yeah, my temple. Dude. A second game from Rip just gave me a headache. The biggest <laughs> headache all of a sudden. <laughs> Those are the kind of- to do that. <laughs> yeah, those are the games. Rip's not gonna win a game off of clean tech and play, you know? He's gonna win the game the best way he knows how, which is just has to win two games. Doesn't matter how pretty it is. <laughs> I mean, the first two rounds were real pretty, actually, and then it got real sloppy. It's, yeah. it's a fine line between playing solid and crazy, you know? Rip's always in between that. <laughs> Hmm. I mean, he, no. It's usually his toes on the on, in, in the solid aspect. Mm. This time he finally put his foot in there, oh, and then he almost like, broke it, broke on it like Conor McGregor. But then he stood back up. <laughs> like where my hand is off camera, that's that's where Rip Solid is. Ooh, but Arctic Snowfall. So, damn, Joey taking it to a wall of stage. He's been doing stage. this a lot recently. Yeah, he's doing the infinite Stop. stage. It's interesting too because I don't consider like Marduk a great infinite character, right? But I think it's more Joey's a great infinite player. So yeah, definitely he's comfortable with that. up all the space, and Marta not too bad at setting up Oki in the open either. He can set up Oki, or he can always just end combos into one plus two air throw and not worry about wall carry, which does a chunk. Right, and you don't even have to worry about the carry wall yeah. positioning because the one plus two throw side switches. Oh, he got the tippy toe tackle. That one's hard to break. No, I ripped did it too early too. He he, he uh, broke the tackle, but you hear him do uh, manual backwards DSS. Oh, that's right. Whenever you hear Law go, <laughs> when he's trying to break when he's trying to break a tackle, that just means they did it too early. Nice jab though. 
As long as Joey doesn't do the forbidden tech of whiffing a one plus two throw in Rip's face. I was just thinking about that. Rip using the new move, no duck on the high there. Only a uh, few characters can punish that uh, Dragon Lance consistently. Right. I was like, how come law players don't use that that much? Ever since, oh, oh no, tackle. Nice like there's, break. There's not a big payoff on hit. Is it the only thing? Yeah, it seems to be very, like just a high crush mid. All right, nice block from Joey. Oh, playing oh, patient. Oh. Super clutch block. That was the one. You know, he and launched that one while standing two, and Rip hasn't gone back to it since. I mean, I think he's. I think he recognizes the risk it is, right? No. Nope. Don't. No tackle though. That's what he's playing off of. It's not willing to bet it. So Joey blocking the slide there, closing out the first round. Whoa, rainbow flip. I mean, that's Rip how you're getting the lead in whichever way he can. There's nice. Drive. And the fat punish too is gonna get hey, decent hey. amount of damage. But now still alive. All jabs. Oh, I like the pressure there from Rip. running in immediately, just throwing out jabs, keeping Joey back uh, back on his feet. Oh, the slide. Oh, doesn't matter though. Flip kicks away, gets the lead. Walks it, didn't launch it, but still got a decent punish. It's yeah, so hard for your that. brain to differentiate between down three and down four in the moment. I hate it. <laughs> I hate it so much. Oh, oh my god! You oh, gotta hop kick those option. tackles. I mean, this. Uh... <laughs> You'll hop kick no, the low okay, yeah, sure. You'll hop kick Rip's the like, hop after. kick? Yeah, okay, sure. I'll hop kick for my Oki. How about that? right up. No worries. I got you. Don't whip in his face. Oh my nice. Why are you yeah. So much? Uh oh. One plus two? Oh, yes. For his life. Oh my <laughs> god! <laughs> you made me off! Rip did the look away. He just he like, look there. Oh, the power. God did it. Nice. Oh, oh the down for one catches the side, so Joey not scared to throw that out. Oh, you can feel the tension in the air. Okay, Rip. No, that's not a punish anymore, Rip. What the? What are you that doing? That was taking six. Oh my God! All my boom box. Not now. Oh. <laughs> oh, oh, yeah. Silence, eliminated shadow. Oh, fly, fly. Wow. Nina players rise up. Fly rage driving sucks. Oh, oh, oh. No, fly, you fly, idiot. Fly, fly. <laughs> Nah, Why no, am I so invested in Rip winning? Oh, <laughs> you gotta go for it Luigi. again. Nice, oh, double he's Luigi. He's turning from the 50 50. He's still gonna run the mix. Well, the 4 3 is now. Oh, oh Joy running looking. the mix now. Joy running the mix. Tackle again. No uh -oh. break. The mix is coming. Rip, fight back. Fight, fight back. back. No, no, not like Why that, though. Not fight? like that. Fight. That was a fake flip. <laughs> he's still oh. stuck on slide mix. He can't get off of it. <laughs> <laughs> I'm so scared. I'm so scared! I can't breathe. Was I'm gonna too attack. lightheaded. He was gonna oh my god. Oh, oh my no. god! Oh my god! Oh, 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 that hurt Damn. me. That hurt Damn. me so much, dude. Oh man, dude. That's the reason. <laughs> oh man. <laughs> It's hard oh. being a Rip fan. I've been a I've been a Rip fan for quite a long time. It's hard to be a Rip fan, but I'm not even a Rip fan. But I'm in the commentary <laughs> booth this week, so I have to have solidarity. Yeah, yeah. Those are the matches that we that we live for, though. That's you know Rip's gonna give you an exciting set like that. <laughs> Damn though, man. He took oh. it down to final final, and then he just... All right, choosing prediction outcome. Rip won. <laughs> uh, all you guys lost your bets. <laughs> oh, damn. Nice job, though. I'm, honestly, you played that damn well, too. Yeah. Uh, like, cause, I cause really you got... wish you would have done a down four or two or something at some point in that set. Yeah, in the last, last round. round. How bad, how bad just that last round. What was I was just like, it? stop sliding and wall standing too. What? Uh, down back three, four, or down four, three, four. Whatever. Down back three, four. Again? How bad is that a block? It's, yeah. That's not launch. Okay. Yeah, you could have jabbed. Or at least four, three, I think. Minus 12, okay. Yeah, that one, there's a couple things, obviously. But that was good. I'm happy. Yeah, it was a good set. It was a good set. Yeah, I think you yeah, played it. I, I think you played it Super real close. well. You know, you're a tournament player, man. You know what it. Is. You know what yeah, it yeah. is. That was close. close. I that said. Was... I said you always keep it interesting. So <laughs> I do. That's the plan, man. It's ICFC. You got to make it interesting. <laughs> what do we got coming up next? Oh, uh, what we got is a big fifty dollar donation from Chris Seglia once again. Ooh, shout out and Brooklyn Ninja, two bucks. Thank you very much. Hey. So shout out to the guys donating to the uh, Matcherino. 
Appreciate and you guys. know, also so thank you guys kinda, for using up all the playing codes. You know, during that weird hype set, right? We also had some breaking news that we kind of glossed over real fast. But Silence eliminates Shadow from the tournament. Wow, so Nina like, Army. Nina. Yeah, the I'm to, where's the Nina Rising Discord? Up, man. Where the, yeah, where the somebody, somebody, somebody give me a link to the Nina Discord. I need to get in there. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I need to figure out what you guys are like. What strats are these guys talking about? Like, all right, like, <laughs> they, were finally, they were finally just like, oh, Willpower finally showed it off. All right, we all got to go win now before they all snitch on us. Though if it's if it's like any other tech in Discord I've been in, it's just full of lewd pictures. <laughs> yeah, I don't know, man. You know, Nina players seem to be pretty pretty normal when it comes to the like the Chloe the Chloe Discord. You know, is full of degenerates. Speaking of Chloe, <laughs> Senpai reacts bringing out the Chloe against Ben Chains Brian. I don't even want to know what that looks like. That sounds terrifying. Chloe Discord. <laughs> it's all, all about right. them. <laughs> no, that was too mean. I can't say it. <laughs> I was going to say, it's all about them, their, their glue-eating strats. But we're going into this. <laughs> no, they're just teaching each other how to count to four. The other side of winner's <laughs> top eight, Bing Chain versus Senpai Relax. And while Senpai Relax is going with all of the female characters now rocking the Chloe, you know, we saw the Kuni Mitsu earlier. We did see the Nina earlier, so Senpai trying to showcase all characters. Bing Chang this time going with the Brian instead. Maybe there's a lot. Maybe, you know, maybe these two are just thinking, like, all right, we got to switch up our characters because, you know... I'm sure these guys have played because these are ICFC staple players, right? They show up every week, so. I wish, oh, I wish one, Bing Chain would switch four. up his Brian outfit. No, he loves his at whack Yeah, outfit. like how Joey loves his striped and leopard printed Marta. Bing you Chang think that's why Shadow outfit. played the ugly Claudio? He just feels like he's got to change up the, the outfit. <laughs> oh, he's got to match up to his environment and just yeah. make it ugly? <laughs> Yeah, hey, Gamer doesn't have any ugly outfits. I gotta no. pick the ugliest Steve outfit. I gotta look for it. It's the really baggy one. Oh, I know neutral about. into the 442. I like that dead. You're right. Nice that Steve outfit's so ugly. Yeah. Oh, God. You gotta rock it. Damn it. Okay. Gamer doesn't have any ugly outfits, so I'm, I'm, I'm screwed. Yeah, they're all pretty cool. His ugliest outfit is the one where he's not wearing any clothes. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. That, to me. <laughs> And to me, that's the best one. That one is pretty good. <laughs> oh, the wall cor corner? All right, fighting out of there, Senpai, relax. Oh, oh get got floated. Off There's the forward four. Haunt fake. Wow, I tried to get a crown here while standing three. Ooh, didn't pick up. Yeah, because the cancel. He doesn't have an OS for that for Brian, huh? He probably does have one. Yeah, it could be one of those things that Ben Chang never really thought about. Now, I'm sure when he picked Brian, he might have picked Brian not for the Chloe, right? He probably picked it for the Cooney or for the uh, Nina. Right. Shut up. Senpai Relax doing all the fake outs. Oh, man, he's gonna need to hit him. Counter there hit! There we go. There we go. Five, six seconds, five. Oh, gotta do something. Ben Chang just nice. holding yeah. it out. Yep, with the strings, just wasting time. I love it. Great yeah, shot. I mean, the only way he could have won there, duck one of those highs, right, get the launch there. But I don't think he was—he was scared about getting hit by the mid. Uh, a little too late there for Senpai Relax. So now Bin Chang up one zero. Dude, I, I expect a character swap here. I, I expect Senpai Relax to try to win this win this game with another character. But well, I don't know. We'll see. I mean, I, the Cooney looked so good. The Nina looked really good too. So, you know. I mean, even the Chloe had some good moments there, even though it lost. But yeah, yeah. It, it, yeah, even that first round, he had the lead too, but then uh, it just, it was that one, one, two, four that Bin Chang got on counter hit with the wall slap that turned it all around. And yeah, it was like, then, he gained momentum and just kind of rode it out. Yeah, it was off of the, he did like one plus two, one on block and then mash one, two, four. That's like, a new pretty, one. Yeah, it's a pretty that, common one now that they gave him that new move, but yeah, big payout. Yeah, one plus two, one. If you don't duck it, he's practically like, I don't know exactly what it is on block, but it feels like it's close to zero. So a lot of times Brian will mash the one two four, mm -hmm. especially against the wall, because you know one two four is a counter it knockdown NCC that will give him a full combo. So yeah, that's really where it all started. But uh, Senpai, I I kind of feel like I want to see the Cooney from him. I want to see the Nina just so I can have practice commentating Nina because apparently that's that's what it's Nina season right now. It's Nina season out there. <laughs> Everyone's winning with Nina. I have a yeah. Cooney. I'm gonna say it's a Nina Williams summer. <laughs> not not for not for Senpai Relax. Still Cooney. We'll see, if this, the, we'll see if this is the right uh, right choice for him though. 
Nice throw. Oh, it's right now. It really is. It's pretty loud. <laughs> the incog gets low parry. Yeah, I like how the one, two, three is the incog. This hell of the incog. <laughs> I never even thought about that string until I played Incog and he just used it like three times. I was like, what yeah. the hell string is this? That <laughs> made me pay attention to 1-2 all of a sudden. Mm -hmm. Ooh, the patience that Senpai relax. Ooh, punish. Nice punish. punish. Yeah. Oh, it's slow on the... Oh. oh, just keep doing it. Man, you know, the other thing too is that I, I think Senpai relax got pretty lucky with the random select too. The infinite stage is definitely going to help him out. Yeah. Ooh, back Ooh. turn throw off of the sidestep two. Yeah, real mixies. That's a one plus two throw. Yeah, the only the only type of real real throw mix you ever get is a back turn throw. If you have a back turn one plus two throw like Fang or like Cooney. Mm -hmm. Or King Giant Swing uh Shining Wizard animation. Those are the same. Yeah. Oof, another back two. Stay in his face, just Ooh. empty dashing. Yeah, interesting choice there. Didn't get much out of it, but look at that. Willing, not scared. Yeah, willing to swing and slug it out. He's like stalking the wind chain. Where's your taunt jet up now, huh? Where? Come on, where's the walls at? Yeah, do your taunt. Do a button. I'm in your face. Oh, oh no, no. Don't do a button. Yeah, I take it all back. I'm happened. sorry, sir. Never mind. <laughs> Whoops. How did I forget? I'm Fury. I'm and sorry, I'm sir. I didn't mean anything. There's a counter and launcher. Hit the button. Everything's a counter hit launcher. Vinch is like, get out of my face, lady. <laughs> You're too close. <laughs> Woo! Alright, there's some power likes trying to create that space now. I hate how that string jails on block. So annoying. Looks like it shouldn't jail. I mean if it if it didn't jail, then Kunimitsu players would say that she's dead. <laughs> <laughs> Unplayable. I, know. I can't <laughs> yeah. wait. It's part of the days that Cooney's unplayable because of 4 2. <laughs> <laughs> then they're going to give her a mid follow up to that. Yeah. Uh -uh. They make 4 4 4 12 frames. Unplayable. You never used it anyway. <laughs> that was my frame. Yeah. I want to see Cooney's actually use that button. Trade still left. Spends the rage. 10 seconds though. Oh. Sliver of life. Nice block. Wow. Bet it. Bin Chang sniffed it out though. Yeah, that was a great block from Bin Chang though. And, you know, I like the I like the attempt for Senpai oh, Relax, oh, but like, oh, 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 lost them and the neutral orbital. Now Bin Chang with the lead in the set. The classic. The, the oh, classic. They have some big whiffs there. Senpai Relax just getting a low poke in though. He could have probably gone for a launch. Yeah, he lost a lot of life real fast. Yeah. See, now Bin Chang playing safe. Oh, but got the mix. Yeah, did a bunch of jazz hands. Ninja stuff! The dazzle to set up the full count. Oh, he tried to do another one. Messed up the third. It wasn't going to be in range anyway, so lucky break that actually didn't come out. Except I relax. Gotta be careful not to get clipped by any counter hit now, because he's going to die uh, regardless. Oh, my oh, God! Oh, profiled! Final chance. Final chance for Senpai. Oh, he tried, but no bueno. Senpai Bin relaxed. Chang. Getting sent to lose Bin Chang. Living. Bin Chang gonna play Joey Fury in the in the Ooh. winners final. Damn, the Bum Damn, Bites winners finals. Let's go. It feels it feels like that's it feels like that's like almost we expect it every week, and yet it's like yeah. one of those things. It also feels very rare now because there's so many so many upsets that happen, right? So you don't mm, see yeah. Joey or Bin Chang always make it here, but you know now it feels like we're back in the swing of things. Bin Chang versus Joey in the winner's side. Uh, Senpai Relax not out yet. Obviously still in the losers bracket. Breaking or noise stuff. popping off. Oh wow! Jay Buckley two over Silence. What match we got coming up next, Tamman? Damn, so Silence out of the tournament, though. Nice showing from Silence. Um, I, honestly, I hope Silence rocked the Nina the entire time. Yeah, not seriously. Not sure, though, because I do know that he does have a nice Eliza, but I'm, he's, he's, a, he's a Nina main 100. I think he's a Nina. Especially after yeah. last week, everyone's back to being a Nina main. Yeah, he, well, he's always been. I feel like it's like he's always been a Nina main, but it's like now it feels like, you know, all the Nina mains are like really. Like Tom Hilfiger's going to come back all of a sudden Damn, with, with, with some like sick. Nina sites of ones. No, he's just going to play Jack again. <laughs> yeah. Oh. yeah. I know, right? I mean, the, the reason why he played Jack was because, like, dude, if I, <laughs> I, I work full time, I, it's easier with Jack. Mm -hmm. Just four, four, one, debug. Oh man, I wanted to play against Jay Buckley. Damn. Nope. If well, you gotta win that? your next match. No, man, I wanted to. I don't want to play Ty or Mac. 
Well, you got well, it's a tough luck, man. Yeah, to get to Jay Buckley, shit. you got to you got to get to Ty or Mac. Hey, yeah. man, you're one game away from the from from the money too. You got I'm, this I'm leaving. Who's the Senpai? Got this. Come on, man. Senpai relax versus Jay Buckley coming in, guys. Get ready to place your bets. Put your boom bucks on the line here. Oh, so Senpai relax got to run the set after getting sent to losers bracket just now. Mm -hmm. You know that's all. And that's always a little tough, right? You, yep. You, you have to have a pretty short memory when you come, when it comes to tournaments. That's the, it's like that's the one thing that's good about Strive's quick rematches is that the, the matches are so fast. Like, all right, I, what happened? Last match, like it never happens. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> like what just happened last match? I don't even remember because I'm really already in the next match. Every fighting game moving forward from now on just has that quick rematch feature because man, <laughs> going from Strive back to Tekken and it's just like. <laughs> but well, Tekken you know, offline is fast. It's just online it has to yeah. reload everything. Uh, yeah, I don't know yeah. why it has to Which reload everything. Sense. Yeah. Why but you know, to... one of the nice things though about this one right now, for at least for Senpai Relax, is that he had some like two minutes to think about that last match, get out of his system immediately because he got a match coming up with Jay Buckley. Yeah, like exactly what Ricky said, Goldfish Brain, man. You mm -hmm. just gotta have what? Goldfish Brain in turn. What is object permanence really? It's just for suckers. Like <laughs> what just happened? Doesn't matter. Whatever. New match. Yep. I mean that's a, it. Really is like you just ha you can't you can't think about it. That's why when Shake someone if, when someone asks you if this is one thing that happens to me all the time. Right? When someone asks you like, hey, why'd you do that in the in that match? I'm like, what? <laughs> what are you talking about? I don't even Dude, remember. I don't, what happened. Yeah, I literally don't remember. Don't remember like, what, what happened in the what match. What did you do in that last you know last round of that last match? It's like I don't even remember what I hit him with. Yeah. You know, like what yeah. the hell? <laughs> it's like I like that's how that's how I approach every tournament match. I forget about it as soon as I lose or I win. I'm just like, yeah. yep. Don't remember. Not just, even, dump the, just dump the mental stack immediately. Just clean that out. It's like, it's over, whatever. <laughs> Why are we talking about my loss? I don't like this anymore. Stop talking about it. <laughs> <laughs> but Jay Buckley sick with the Bob this time, not the Steve, unfortunate. Now, one, two, four from Queen Mitsu goes on punish. It is minus 14. Ooh, hell sweet though, Jay Buckley. Whoa! Oh, what Ninja a maneuver. starter. So that must be really easy to hit him from, right? I've never, because when I first saw that move and like practice, I was like, oh, that's not a move I, I'm going to see Kunimitsu use, but Senpai Relax uses it a ton. I oh. feel like a lot of Kunis use it a ton. Yeah, I think I, th I think it was just a bad read on my part because I didn't understand how good the move was. Yeah, me neither. She's like really actually Ooh. gone. Yeah. Dash dash one though, finds its mark. Damn, Jay Buckley's got a bob. What, you thought, you thought that when he beat I've <laughs> only seen his Steve. That's why this is like new to me. I've seen his bars online. He doesn't want to play you with the with the Bob, man. Good. <laughs> <laughs> wow. Oh, challenges wow. with the hop knee. Just the one. Going for carry. Oh, just missed it though. Ooh. Okay. Damn, dude, that does a wall spot? It does, but your okay. back has to be directly on the wall. Yeah, it's like Elisa's unblockable. Mm. Man, a J Buffy. Ooh, I like. Are you using the no, little wafers? Ooh. Fat boy wave, uh, dude. Bob has the best wave because oh. he's, he's so fat. It looks so fun. Yeah, he was when messing you... those uh full crouch down four threes against Bing Chang too. And he messed up right there at the end. It would have got blocked anyways. Nice. Oh, he really, he really wanted, wanted it. Dude, he really <laughs> wanted to kill him. Oh, Holy moly! Yeah, that was crazy. Jesus. I got another step on the string too. He was These guys are doing some good side step. So you can okay. That was tight. If he had if he had gotten that, bro, that come been on, sick man. As hell. Yeah. Breaking news, Mac eliminates Ty two to one. To earn the right to versus to place Rip. To earn the right? <laughs> <laughs> who wrote that? Who, who was writing who wrote, Is it yeah. Tan Man? <laughs> Who's writing a ticker tonight? They're a little spicy. Yeah. <laughs> earn the right. I didn't think it was Tan Man. Tan Man wouldn't say that. I think I know who it is actually. Nice duck again. Damn, Jay Buckley 3-0 real fast against Senpai yeah, Relax. Dude. Okay, I take it back. Remember how I said I want to play these guys? I don't want to play these guys anymore. <laughs> <laughs> Senpai really is going to have to relax here because, you know, that was a bad 3-0. Uh, well, maybe he doesn't know Nina. Maybe now's the time to go back to the Nina. I mean, we saw the Chloe earlier, too. So, so I mean, Senpai Relax does have a lot of characters. But yeah, this is where, where having so many characters can be, a, you know, a detriment to your game, right? Because you don't have a, a reliable, like, this is my tournament character. This is what I got to go to, right? So, mm -hmm. We'll see. You know, maybe he want to stick out with the Kunimitsu because, um, you know, for me, I when I think of Senpai Relax and the multiple times I've played him, it's always been the Kuni that I always yeah. thought like this is the character that he's the best with. So right now it's not looking too hot, but 
Cooney is a good bet, I think. It's just that uh, he went for some 50-50s and he guessed wrong on the offensive. So, like, just flip it around. You know, just guess right. I don't mm -hmm. know. He's trying too hard, I think, especially to force that full crouch mix and just mix uh, Jay Buckley up with the, like, the standard, like, Cooney mix up, like, 1-1 one, one in the stuff. Man, if that's sure you can get hit, Mm. I would have popped so hard. Like we <laughs> popped and he, and he did it, he got blocked. It's like, too. And he did it fast. That's why we were just like, whoa, that was what was at the end of that <laughs> sidestep. Holy moly. He like, thank your lucky stars you recovered in time. But Jay Buckley like looks like he's ready for like the standard Cooney like mix up stuff. So yeah. Senpai Relax wants to play this Cooney Mitsu. He's gotta dial it back and just try to maybe grind it out a little bit slower. Yeah, just play solid tech and yeah. fundamental tech and take your pokes, you know, establish some conditioning with some lows and mids and then get in there. It's not like Cooney has like the best low pokes, but they're doable. Yeah, they're fine. They'll do its job. Down back four is fine. Yeah. Down, down back three, three is another serviceable one. Yeah. All right, though, so infinite is sure. So I think Round one. gonna try to go with the no walls. It's probably best for him too. I think he, he benefits the most without walls. Oh, nice step. Nice oh, big step. Jay Buckley. Jay Buckley with all the <laughs> right movement. Okay, okay. Wave yeah. dashing a little too hard in his face. Yeah, he wasn't uh, having that. You think you're nice? <laughs> Hop kick. I mean, that was nice. I love, I love Bob Fat Man wave dash. Dude, it's so sick. I always feel like I have the crispiest wave dash when I use him too. It's just like you can tell exactly when you're yeah. down and down <laughs> forwards are coming up. Man, the rush down here from Jay Buckley looking so good here. So winner, this is a basically a money match, right? Because winner gets into the top four. So. Oh shit! You're right. Yeah, it's a big match for both of these players. Hey, hey. Senpai hasn't been able to get anything going so far. Oh man, Jay Buckley's just looking so clean with his yeah, offense. Yeah, he's so clean, so comfortable, just in and out right now, and getting his hits in. And Senpai isn't able to open him up. Open nice. Oh, Which nice. up? Yeah. Uh, Jay Buckley's showing off his yeah, he's, wall standing for his up. movement, he can't pin him down. He's uh -oh. wasting too much time trying to cover the distance to get into Jay Buckley's face. Jay Buckley moving too fast. Yeah, so now Senpai Relax down five rounds straight here. He's down bad, as the kids would say. <laughs> oh, there Shows we go. Violence. Oh. The drop oh. to the combo, though. He's so fat. Yeah, How do you drop, drop it? Music? Oh, and uh, Jay Buckley has been hitting every hell sweep that he's thrown out. Yeah. He's looking clean right now. This is scary. He's so clean right oh, now. Oh, he ducked that, but still got counter clear. hit. Oh, no. He tried to move or something after the 2 1, <laughs> and then that's a wrap. Blanca ball God to close damn. it out. Blanca ball to Blanca ball? What is he, yeah. May player? What is this? <laughs> dolphin at the Dolphin? Yeah, I'm going to mod my T7 for that. Like, Totsugeki! Uh, for Bob's Blanca ball? That'd be sick. That was two, right? That yeah. was two. That was Jay Buckley. That was too fast. That's what that was. Super fast. And all yeah. control from Jay Buckley. Nice job, Jay Buckley. Moving on. Top four. I don't what if I believe this is his first top four, right? So Yeah. Right. And that is a clean top four too, right? He I mean, because he looked so good in that match. Now we got Rip versus Mac. Rip went down to Joey. Now he has to play against his Buffalo brother Mac. I think Buffalo. Sure Buffalo. Or wherever they're from. Rip versus Mac. I don't know. Rip, when was the last time you played Mac? Uh, we played uh, like four weeks ago or something like that. Um, it did not go well for me. Was that when, was that when he was a Devil Jin main? <laughs> no, that was before he became a Devil Jin main. Oh, man. Well, I wonder what character he's going to choose against you. Uh, I don't know. Probably Bob. Uh, Gilkey's we'll like, if I bet on you for this match, you're going to play like a dumbass? Gilkey, that's my secret. I always play like a dumbass. Don't tell anybody. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> He's like the Hulk from the Avengers. One exactly. Like, That's my secret. I'm always angry. And the, and the funny part That's is, my secret. I'm always the funny the part is, the funny part is, it's not really a secret either. No. Everyone knows I know. it. It's like, but, the, but the, you know, the, no, no, but, but the nobody issue, wants to say it. Like, no, 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 no. The issue is, is that when you play him, then he starts doing some some solid stuff, and you're like, wait, he's not playing like a dumbass anymore. I know. He lied to me. He tricked me. He's just, just trying luring to, you in. Just yeah. Like, Come on. <laughs> Mixed you in real life. Damn. <laughs> The you game get, before the game. You get sucked into this, into this false sense of security that you're playing solid, normal Tekken, and then he does some some stuff. It's like, oh yeah, I'm playing against Rip. I forgot. Mm -hmm. Right when you. That's Rip's greatest low. strength. Rip's yeah. greatest strength is making you forget that you're playing Rip. 
<laughs> it's a skill. I don't know how he does it. I don't even know how you been playing for twenty years. <laughs> Somebody gets in, like, why would he flip kick? <laughs> it's rip, bro. <laughs> and then they like, oh yeah, he's <laughs> like, you're right. Yeah, that is right. I rip obviously with the law. Matt going with the bob this time. Jungle outpost two here. Rip loving this outfit ever since he wore it. Oh my god, <laughs> Bob looking like a big ass. <laughs> That stack of cotton candy oh. gets down for two immediately. Oh man, he looks like the freaking tile section at a freaking uh, Home Depot or something. <laughs> he looks like a wallpaper that would be like in a candy store. Yeah. Oh, down for two there. Mac getting that counter hit. That's a big one. Goes for unskilled rather than more wall carry. Yeah, I think he might might have been able to hit the wall too with down two two four. Mm -hmm. You see Rip trying to sidestep out, Mac not doing it, so Rip slides underneath, switches his position now. Oh, oh. oh. he knew it wasn't going to be in time, so he didn't pull the whole trigger. Yeah, that was scary, though, from both players. Rip had a big whiff there, but that was because Mac whiffed earlier. Ooh, the blue ball comes ball. in. Nice. Rip. Mac's been doing that a lot, just like not rolling after rage drive and just taking, what is it, like, I think it's like plus two if you don't roll or something like that. That's pretty much negligible. Plus two at that range, but I guess, yeah. And a lot, think, of, a lot of times it's just like a habit, right? You block a raise drive and you're not going to swing afterward most yeah. of the time. Yeah, especially because you also know that there's a roll after that too. So you might be thinking already in the mindset, all right, I got to block this roll. I got to make sure yeah. I block the mid or the low. But when he stops right there, then you're like, wait, what? Yeah. <laughs> It's by like the time more you, mental friends than actual real yeah, friends. Yeah, by, by the time you even try to react, you're already minus 10. Mm hmm. It's just something I've noticed from Mac lately that he doesn't commit to the ball mix up as much. I, yeah, I like that. I yeah. like it. I like. I it. like it too. Cause the the ball mix up so committal, you know. Oh, Junkyard. Look. Nice walk. Nice walk, but I mean Mac didn't low parry that. He just blocked it. I mean low parry would have gotten the round, but it doesn't matter anyways. He's up 2-0 here. Oh, oh man, <laughs> that one felt real bad. That sounded like a gunshot. Dude, Rip's so mad. He's like, man, fucking while the standing four fucking sucks now, bro. Look at that. Oh. He just crouched that one my whiff. I mean, that was a big whiff, and Max was in that range, right? He was waiting for something to whiff like that. That's kind of the way he's, his game plan is, right? Yeah, and especially when you can nullify his magic four like that. Mm. Bro. And nullify his slash kick? I don't know, man. Rip's not looking too good here against Matt. That was a great jab, too. Mac playing that game so solid there. Uh, the jab is something that Joey's really good at, too. Just jabbing you out of the air when people try to force things with, like, that slash kick. Mm -hmm. yeah. I mean, those are some things that you always had to have to kind of keep in mind, too. It's like, you know, when certain characters have that, those kind of moves. Like, and Rip, as a player, he likes to use the, the slash kick a lot. So to, to get in close distance and get plus frames. So if you're willing to throw out that jab there to float him out, you know, go for it. Because, it because you know, obviously you can convert off of it big if you do. So, And that's really good uh, presence of mind for Mac there. Like, he, like, that's a tournament player. He's a veteran, you know. He understands the pace of the match. He's like, I have a big enough lead. I don't really have to worry about anything too crazy. Uh, I keep backdashing away. You know, you, all of your pokes aren't hitting me. You're really going to try to force something here. What's mm -hmm. that answer? And most of the time, it's going to be a running three. Yeah. Steve running two or something. It's a good time to check. Just, with the especially jab. for those characters where they're Got not. It. They don't have that many options from that mid far range like they're characters that want to get in man i um, felt like a lot of the damage that came from max side too was just a lot of just patience right he got a lot of whiff punishes got you know a few counter hits here and there but the majority of the times was you know just being patient keeping that space and you know punishing with the crouch dash one you know and things like that though i think the one time like in the beginning of that first round where rip got a like the launch immediate launch i feel like that was when mac was gonna go for immediate for like immediate hell sweep like just to like put it in his mind, like here's a hell sweep, but he got counter hit. Didn't even go for the hell sweep again. He's like, whatever, no, I don't even need it. Whatever, man, this ain't worth it. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> that's I, the thing, right? Having the tool is great, but also having the threat of it sometimes is good enough because yeah. it's like they already know about it. I don't need to do it. That's why I do the mix, you know. I th that's the one thing I like about Max Bob a lot is that he doesn't go for the hell sweep a lot, but when he does, it's like, oh, it's gonna always hit because he doesn't throw it out enough for you to like think about it, you know. Yeah. When he does do it, it's like it's on sale. He's got to yeah. get them all out the door. It's like <laughs> it's weird yeah. for me. Whenever I play Bob, out of all the Mishima style movement characters, I'm like I hell sweep a lot with Bob and mm -hmm. and Devil Jin. But when I'm playing like Kazuya or one of the other ones, I'm just like don't hell sweep as much. I don't know what it is. Oh, Damn, man. the quadruple oh. low parry. 
didn't work out for Mac. Oh, Took the bat, sidewall. Yeah, sidewall's gonna I mess up that combo. Oh man, but Rip not swinging here. I think he could have got a few, yeah, a few opportunities he had to close out the round. But no. uh oh, <laughs> slowly finding his mark. Twenty seconds left, and trying to keep that wall positioning, but finds a back two to get out. Mac using the T6 Bob costume, trying to give Rip some shell shock. <laughs> like no, not you, not this character. It's actually very funny because when I think about oh, T6, oh, 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 oh. <laughs> throwback. You play, we're playing T6 again, huh? <laughs> I remember T6 Bob's 442 being like an almost completely different move. Yeah, it wasn't it was even, it's it was the same animation, but it's like a high. It was, like same, a high, it was, a high. Like, yeah. yep. it was not useful. That's what it was. Yeah, it was practically useless. You don't, don't know the reason it, for it. It got good when they made it a bound in Tekken Tag 2, and then it got better when they just made it a good move in Tekken mm. 7. It's a great move. Such a like long range neutral killer. Yeah. Right, rip up 2 0 here. Looking solid. Nice. nice. Oh. The patience there. Cobb Mac doing a low counter hit. I'm going to get the wall. Yeah, forcing Ooh. Mac to get impatient. Try to force it. Wow. Oh. Damn. Just throws it out there. Down forward once. Oh. Oh. The step. You knew he was going to block that. Still alive. Final chance for Mac. Oh, what do you no. <laughs> Rip is so crazy sometimes. <laughs> oh my god. Just just do big flips for like 20 seconds. Yeah, something. Oh my god. Oh, oh my god. Here we go. No. No. Oh, oh wow. Back and it all on that backswing blow. I mean, he only had 13 seconds, right? So he needed to get a launcher in somewhere. I think the backswing blow was the his opportunity. He tried it, but it didn't pay out, so. Nice. I mean, that was good from Rip. I, I some, some, you know, it's a little scary, right? But the, that's Rip doesn't like to win easy. He doesn't that's like another a, thing there too. Like there was only thirteen seconds left, and Rip had like sixty percent life. Yeah. So he was like, "I'm fine with taking like three, four hell sleeps. And you're probably gonna burn up the clock before you can even land those hell sleeps." Like, and he, and I think Rip, if if he did get hell sweeps, he was willing to just stay on the stay floor. on the ground. Yeah, right? burn the clock. Yeah. Well, the issue is though, his back was to the wall. If you stay on the ground, Bob can get still get mad damage, right? With down, down a uh, three plus four, I think we'll pick up even uh, wouldn't even wouldn't up four three, three plus four down one, yeah, yeah. He has, so he has Bob has a lot of things that can mess you up on the ground. So that would have been kind of risky, but you know, Mac didn't show the hell sweep there. So that's I, you know, that was a good job from Rip to just you know play patient and win it out there. I, li I really like that down forward two in the last round that he got him with. I, I, yeah. Rip does not do enough wall down forward two, I feel like. Especially when I can play, compare him to somebody like Tay. Like, Dante's mm. down forward twos are magic, and I wish more people tried to emulate it a little bit. I, I think that, like that was a trait of Rip's old school old, style. Yeah, he, yeah. He, the older Tekken, maybe Tekken 6 style mm -hmm. Rip was definitely more down forward two heavy. You know, I think now it's more, he doesn't want to, you know, want to play that game. He wants to hop kick or, you know. Oh, yeah, he's definitely taken to the skies ever since he got older. He's just like, I don't want to have my feet planted on the ground. I am ready, Jesus. Take me up. <laughs> <laughs> Lord, take me. <laughs> Lord, take me up. Hot kicks, take me to heaven. Let's go. Jesus, take the stick. <laughs> Jesus, take the kick. Oh, shit. Oh, did it finish it? Didn't finish either of those strings, but you know, obviously hard. Not easy to do. Wow, Rip ducking a ton, but Rip still <laughs> wearing the yellow jumpsuit. I don't know. He might have depowered himself here. No, he wore this the last game and he won. Oh shoot. He wore he wore this ugly ass outfit. I don't like this one either. <laughs> I think that's the reason why he chose it. He's like, it's it's about today's fashion week for ugly for the ugly fashion. Oh <laughs> and then the hop kick. I take to the skies. Duck to back three. Oh yeah! Oh man, oh, good patience from Mac. Oh, that's getting scary. So, oh, oh god! Nice, nice boys! Oh, oh. He side rolls the down three plus four and gets the fake flip launcher to take the round. What a round! Yeah, I don't know what Mac did there. He saw the flip and he swung at it and got clipped. I mean, Rip will use that fake flip and it sucks when you get hit by it. You know, you I know it's messed up. If you're a really good player and your whip punishing is yes. super on point, yes. that's what you I was going to say. see the fake flip and you're like, punish. Oh, mm -hmm. shit. <laughs> that's exactly what I was, what I was saying. You, 
because you're you're trying to be on point with those whip punishes like that, the fake flip is the one that catches you off guard. Yeah, it's the it's the visual thing. It's a oh nice, nice punish. punish. That wouldn't have been a punish earlier, <laughs> right? That's, <laughs> he wouldn't have a 15 frame launcher back in the day. It's not the most damage, but it definitely is better than what he used to have. Yeah, four, two, three. I mean, Mac would have punished from four, two, three, regardless. Anyway, he's like he loves using that move as a as a whip punish or just a regular punish. But yeah, it's a great one. Up four, four is a great great punish now for Bob. Ooh, try to chase him. Didn't damn ran out with DSS three. Yeah, that was an interesting choice. Maybe it was to like counter getting uh, uh, jabbed out of the air from a slash. Oh, stop on his foot! Oh, yeah. but one it's too a running many. Three. One too many again. Rip really trying to force the plus frames with the slash Round kick. Three. Max sniffing it out with the anti-air jab again. Taking right. it to the skies. Jesus, I'm coming. Oh, tried to slide, messed up. Nice, oh, got the block into the whiff punish. Bad banana peel there from Rip. Can get damage here. No side roll there. Oh, slides the, away. Yeah, the slide. Has the pin, but Max trying to the back. How did he get the back? No, oh, oh, no, no. Big hop kick. <laughs> oh, wow, cut it. He's a madman. He's a madman. You're a madman. <laughs> Rip one nice. round away from making the money at ICFC. Oh my god. <laughs> I can't do this. Yo, they're not doing I, anything, they're just moving in and out. I'm not gonna yeah, say what Avery wrote in the it. I'm not gonna say what Avery wrote in the chat, but I see you. I like it. <laughs> Alright, Rip. Looking good here. Wow, well, then now just Nobody wants shit. to crack. Nobody wants to crack. Hey, Max getting challenge. the smallest of leads. Max 30 seconds and they barely done anything. Lows. Coming oh out of both players. God. Who has the Yo. lead? I don't even know anymore. This is I mean, so okay. Like, Mac got the lead. Oh, he's definitely got the lead. <laughs> Still enough time to do this. Still oh. enough time. 15, 14. Delay, get up three. Couple of lows. Oh, ah! Nurse. Oh, what a stop. Oh, oh. My God. he ducked for it. Back cracked at the end, Rip moving into the money. Wow, Rip making it into the money top four. Ooh, man, Mac out in fifth place. And that's a pretty big upset, too, considering that Mac has been doing well in these ICFCs, right? He, ha he has a lot of points, but he's in the last spot of the of the top eight in the, in the point standings. He's going to have more points here, but Rip now in the top four. Ooh. And you know, Rip did say he wanted to play Jay Buckley. He wanted to play Jay Buckley. Yeah. And he got his wish. He's going to get to play Jay Buckley. But we back. also have two great players in the winner's side as well. Ben Chang and Joey Fury. I believe they're going to probably play next. But man, nice job, man. Rip. I mean, you know, the funny thing too is that match was real close because you could tell at a certain point, Max stopped trying to whiff punish a lot because he was yeah. honestly just like, oh man, what is Rip going to do here? What the hell is he doing? Honestly too, Rip started hitting the brakes on a lot of things, mm -hmm. really started making uh, Mac uncomfortable with his patience. And then like yeah. Mac started to crack a little bit. He tried to run in with his own slash kicks and force his own plus his, frames. You know, it's like what, what we used to know Rip for a lot in the back, back in the day was that when he played against someone like a turtle, right? His, his game plan against the turtle was to yeah. out turtle them yep. it's like and we haven't seen that rip in forever but that last round felt like that was what rip was doing he's like i'm gonna yeah. just out turtle you because why not you know let me see that what was you're actually do. sick to see both players like dude mac really needs this round to close it out rip just needs this one to close the whole setup and mm -hmm. rip and mac both like had this mutual agreement at the beginning of the round it's just like we ain't gonna do anything until like the 20 second mark <laughs> <laughs> Yo, thanks for all the ICFC emotes, Chad. You guys pulled through. <laughs> <laughs> nice job, Rip. Keep it up. Keep it oh, up. Man. I mean, you, you well, now you get to play against another Bob or maybe another Steve. Who knows what j is going to be Fantastic. Man. You got this on. <laughs> Fantastic. <laughs> you're, but what are you doing? Well, you're playing Tekken 6 again. That's why. You're playing against yeah. all these Tekken 6 characters. So <laughs> honestly, <laughs> the best. I only Rip. lost to these fucking characters in Tekken 6. <laughs> Yeah, but see, now you're getting your revenge. Yeah, like, now you oh, have a bunch of resentment to get out. <laughs> yeah. mm -hmm. Get it off your chest. Get it off your I've chest. Waited, I've waited two Tekkens for this moment, you damn Tekken no, 6 characters. Actually, to be honest, I wanted to beat Mac because last week when I was playing Shadow, Mac was in the chat and he said some shit like, uh, man, if Rip beats Shadow, I'm going to DQ myself. I'm like, all right, I see oh. you, Mac. Oh. 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 
Oh man, now you're gonna get a Twitter post and a written letter and all this weird stuff, man. Oh, you want to be on Max Twitter like that? He's gonna make a video <laughs> about you when, as soon as he jumps out of the shower, gets in the hey, car. Hey, look, man, I'm just I'm just a West Coast Korean. You know that's how we beat him out here. <laughs> Damn. <laughs> Man, Rip gets one game, one victory. <laughs> I know. I'm, talking all like, I'm in the money, baby. I'm in the money. <laughs> Atta boy, keep it up. All right, we got. <laughs> we got Bing Chang with Bing. the gin. Hey, everyone's got L U I T thug emotes. It's okay. Yeah, uh, he's yeah, been trying Bing out Chang. the gin ever since like two weeks ago on uh, Bud Light. And yeah, then, saw, uh, he, yeah, he he won last week or the last Bud this Light with gin, right? Yeah. Mm -hmm. This was the one that was able to finally answer Dude. that. <laughs> okay. <laughs> That's what right. started. Why did they give him this? And why did they give him this? Oh, prediction shit. Oh. Spoilers on the predictions. Nah, it's three games. And you know, Ben Chang and Joey, there's you can't get spoiled off of the one, yeah, one round. Dude, it's impossible. All the money I made bet. from Boom Bucks this week, I lost it all. You bet against me? <laughs> 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 I didn't bet it. I didn't bet that one. I knew you'd lose again, Mike. I was trying to get you not bet on me. <laughs> oh man, it was for the greater good. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Bin Chang. Damn, same combo, same situation, same oh, everything. What is happening? We'll just replay the match with better combo. Better... This character, Jin Jesus. Kazama, please. I thought this character was dead. Bro, when he's... they gave him the new wall carry, that's yeah. why. <laughs> He I mean, died he, because of that, bro. <laughs> he, did, he did two electrics and they both counter hit and they both did hella damage. They both reached the wall. They both did max damage. Oh, in the back. Crazy. Oh, fish hook beating down four two. Down back three, high crushing the electric. Man, I remember when 7.0 came out, I was thinking to myself, I'm going to be a Jin or a Steve player because I want to learn how to play <laughs> these characters. Boy, was I stupid. <laughs> I should have done it. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> LLRK. Pressure coming out of Ben Chang, though. This is looking nice. I like Joey just walking up and just playing patient, but you can't play patient too long. He's got to win this round. Battle of the jabs right now. 15 seconds. What's Joey going to do? Ben Chang with the slight lead now. A little bit. Ooh. Now the real game starts. 10 seconds. Ooh, nice. What a yeah. Yeah. But LLRK. After getting hit by one, two, two, he just said, screw it, let's just do this? How do you wow. one, two, two somebody in the grill, have your advantage, and then just let them hell sweep you like that afterward? That's because Joey definitely wasn't expecting that of all things, right? That was the last thing anyone of like, uh, suspected, right? You think you one, two, two, Joey has a lead, right? Joey's gonna, has the advantage. He's gonna, he's gonna, you know. Yeah, I punched this guy in the face. He's gonna chill out. Whoa, why am I on the floor? What the hell happened? That was yeah, a what great lead from Ben Chang, cause it was like less than 10 seconds left. And then Joey mm -hmm. was just like, I solidified my lead. You could totally feel that just by watching. And then like Ben Chang realized this and he's just like, oh, you're just gonna sit on your lead? Let me check your ankles. Boom, LLRK! Yeah, boom! <laughs> yeah, just, just wanted, you gotta check them sometimes, right? Sometimes when you're throwing it out like that, like, you know you're about to lose if you don't do something like that, right? Now, yeah. LLRK's gonna the win The way he round. made it look was just perfect. He was just like, you're gonna run the clock, I'm gonna sweep you. Yeah. Screw that. Man, that was a 3-0. Quick 3-0 there from Bin Chang. The gym looking good. I wonder if we're gonna see a character swap from Joey. Or if he's gonna stick with the Fang the entire way through. Man, I'm actually, you know, the gym. It looked good, but it was really just like everything started from electric right at the beginning of the round. Electric, and then that spectacular wall, wall carry, wall combo, flip into wall counter carry. hit standing four. Like both of those two yeah. rounds went exactly the same for like the first 10 seconds. It really felt like the only round Joey got to play was that last round, which is why it was kind of close, you know? So I don't think <laughs> I don't think he needs to switch characters. I just don't get hit by electric right off the bat and play those first two rounds. Oh, easy. Okay. <laughs> Jen is the only <laughs> Mishima, or like he's like a pseudo Mishima, but. Like his electric wasn't part of that three frame recovery buff that the other Mishima's got. So mm. his electric is still the same recovery as it's always been. It's still a normal electric, not a bullshit electric. I see. Yeah, so it's still <laughs> mad hard to whiff punish, but yeah. just not as hard as the other Mishima's. All right, game number two here, Bin Chang up 1-0. All right, the electric finally got one. I love Joey's usage of up four, three plus four, man. Mm -hmm. He's the only person that uses that move, I swear. Right? Did Nashi use that? Is this Nashi's Not thing? Long, uh, Nashi didn't used to use it very much. Nashi's in there somewhere in Joey right now. He's speaking <laughs> to us with like the 4 plus 4. <laughs> yeah, exactly. Exactly. Or sell. <laughs> he just absorbed Nashi, dude. He's one with him now. Fight. 
Where's Energy Marta? Did Joey absorb him too? <laughs> <laughs> That's how Joey gets stronger. Damn it. Damn, makes so much sense. Who can I fuse with? Come on. <laughs> I gotta be the primary though. I gotta say. <laughs> Extra plus frames because the flip over. What? Slower pace. I mean, no walls here, so Bin Cheng, you know, his damage gets uh, reduced quite a bit. Winning it out with some 2 1. Wow. So, Joey with the whip punish at 10 with the 4 1 plus 2, but it's too slow. That move is like 19, 20 frames. Yeah, it's st that's still one of Fang's problems. Like, he doesn't have a fast whip mid punisher outside of shoulder. shoulder. Yeah, and yeah that's shoulder not shoulder. And even outside of shoulder range, what do you do? Yeah. yeah. Mm -hmm. You have to have, like, the godlike reactions to get forward 3 plus uh, 1 plus 2 or forward 3 4. Uh huh. Those are all, like, 20 frame moves. That's slow. Five seconds, but he pushed Bin Chang out. Oh, and now one down three, the classics. Always got to pay attention to that. Sometimes you got to bring out the old school. Nice. Wow. That was, that was clean. Like, yeah, great whip punish there. Not the best combo, but I mean, he got can can on the side. I bet you that was the first yeah. time he's ever done that. Oh, oh. <laughs> he's learning all these side things now. <laughs> <laughs> I know, he's just making it up on the fly, dude. He's like, uh, what do I do with this one? Well, he tried to do LLRK, but Joey got up with the get up three. Gonna get the little combo here. Bing Chang is holding back after that recovery. That's usually pretty <laughs> risky, but... Man, punishing back one there, too. Oh, mm -hmm. it all. like we said. And Bin Chang looking real solid here now. Up two rounds to one in the game number two. Hard to get that for a whiff punish, unless it's a huge whiff. And you had it, like, kind of scouted. Yeah, 4-3 is not necessarily the... I mean, the range is good, but the, the speed of it's not so hot. So, like, you have to really be on point with your with your whiff punishing with that. 100%. And if you miss it, you're dead. Dead. Wow. wow. Weibu into it this time. Taking yeah, the Savage scary. Sword Ender. He plays Jin like a real Mishima too, you know? Like yep. he, that, that crowd dash makes him as real. And he casts him to the Wild Sand too sometimes too. Dude, and Jin doesn't even need to take a risk on the mid. He can just do 4-4-3. Four, four, such a stupid character. <laughs> <laughs> Man, I felt... I felt some malice in those words. Yeah. <laughs> Stupid character. Stupid character. Oh, man, Ben Chank up 2-0 with the stupid character. <laughs> you got to emphasize every syllable of the stupid, 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 stupid character. You know what, though? That, that means that that means that you're playing good gin players. Because if you never yeah. play, if you if you don't say anything, if you don't say another character is stupid, then it's like you never really played against a good one, I guess, yeah. right? Or that that's, a per, yeah, that's a perfect example. And, like, uh, the only time you hate a character is when somebody's really good with them. Mm-hmm. Mm -hmm. And you know what, Jin's LLRK like is one of those lows that have always been debated for the longest time. You could see it, bro. It's so slow. Like you could <laughs> you could react to it, man. Like you motherfuckers, swear to God, you could react to all these fucking lows. And then I see you guys in tournament getting your back blown out by Oscar down one plus two. And like, you guys say you guys make all these clips saying that you can block it, but in tournament time, does it happen? <laughs> You have anything else you need to get out there, Mike? <laughs> stupid lows, God! <laughs> stupid! <laughs> I'm sure when Mike said that stupid, like, one of his eyes closed, you know? Cause it's... <laughs> uh, <laughs> <laughs> too many weeks of... Good, too many weeks of Mike just being happy-go-lucky. He had to let it out at some point. You know, yeah, you, someone, someone's got to take Mike's heat and, and sorry, Jin. <laughs> <laughs> hey, that Mike's a former Jin man. He started yeah, with the Jin. He knows. I did. Uh-huh. And then he went, nah, this guy's not blonde enough for me. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Marta comes out to play, though, for Joey. The Fang wasn't doing it for him. And he gets an infinite Azure, too. So I think that's going to also benefit Joey as well. But we'll see hmm. Bin Chang. You know, one thing about Bin Chang's Jin is I. Uh, we haven't seen a parry once, so I don't think he's very, you know, not he's, yeah. like he's still learning Jin, right? Because you he doesn't even <laughs> use the parry that much. He's not the parry. Oh, no! my oh God, he's playing he's playing Jin Mashima, right? Not Jin yeah. Mashima. Uh, exactly. Yeah. Did he uh, electric the tackle? By the way. Yeah, it looked, looked like he did. did. Yeah. yeah, he did. Whoa, oh, Joey going for mix. With oh, oh and get then up the three's dead here. here. Yeah. Every time, it's, so that's happened multiple times there where, where Bin Chang gets a knockdown. And he tries to do like a he force a wave dash mix up. He makes up, yeah, yeah on the attack roll, but Joey stays down and gets a get up three on that timing instead. Yeah, maybe he's, gotta, he's done it multiple Keep that in mind and just like try to counter his get up three with like a down back four or something. Yeah. 
So, you know, maybe just pull the brakes, find a little low parry to block it or something. But both or you times can do like a, a meaty option where it will hit him grounded with the that's big, big boy. It don't yeah, work. You gotta, you gotta do this whack combo. Even Shout though <laughs> they're huge, those combos that flip them over with the head towards you like that, those type of launchers, you don't get the same combos on big, big body, boys. tiny head. Yeah, exactly. Even though they they they're huge. Hey. Oh. <laughs> the hurt box of that type of knockdown animation makes their head like pretty much inhittable. Unhittable. Nice though. Bing Chain taking it here. Tying Especially it the way that Bing Chang's playing Jin like a Mishima, like you guys said. Like, Marduk. <laughs> Mishimas are actually one of Marduk's most annoying matchups. Because mm -hmm. he can't try and. St even though it's like it's hard to step electric anyway in this game, he definitely is hard for him to step electric. They got those big shoulders, man. Tiny legs, but big And then you add Jin's ability to just throw out moves like that forward four in the mid range. Yep. Yeah. And you know what I don't see Jin players use enough? You know how like the one weakness to Jin mm. is sidestep right against forward four and electric, yeah. right? I would just fucking use Zen three or while standing three all day then. What yep. are you going to do about that? It's a yeah, mid counter it. launcher that gives the same combo as electric. What's yeah, they only use, they they only usually use Zen three after they like after four four like when they transition oh. into Zen off of a move. Yeah, mm -hmm. raw Zen three. Yeah, you're right. It, it eats up jabs in that scenario, but like raw Zen three is freaking amazing. It has great range, mid counter it launcher, homing. I think the only thing that they don't like is the fact that you kind of lose your pressure if it gets blocked. Right, so you're yeah. just like, all right, well. My turn's done. Your but turn. Then it's kind of the same deal with forward four, kind of a little bit. Yeah, you, you have four. a little wiggle room with a couple choices, but nice duck on the jabs. Oh man, Ben Chang's playing so well here, though. Gonna get big combos here. Joey with the little lead here. Wow. 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 Just just the break. Yeah, that was just a break. <laughs> oh no, one too many buttons. Damn, <laughs> that tackle break was sick. <laughs> All right, final round here, game number three. <laughs> Good break on the tech. Wow, and Joe or uh, Binchang's uh, blocks on these lows have been so great today. Mm -hmm. Yeah, and I love that he goes for the hop kick combo afterwards. Totally tournament safe. Good damage, I love, too. I love that Joey just is bringing out all these different Binchang characters, you know? Like, it's like, damn, I can't be with this character. I guess I gotta try something new. Jin Kazama, you know? <laughs> the story between these guys have been pretty interesting because Joey's been getting him a lot during Bud Light, but ever since this week, uh, Bin Chang picked up Jin against him. It seems like it's the choice against Ooh. Joey. Oh, that's Trans it. No. One, two, three, and it's hey, over. Wow. Bin Chang wow. over Joey Fury. 3-0 in the winner's final. He's on to something with this Jin against Joey. The Jin, is, the Jin is looking real strong here. I mean, it's and it's also just because he's not necessarily, you know, a lot of the electrics are hitting, a lot of the mix-ups are hitting, and it's just overall solid play, you know? And like, I don't, I, don't, I don't even know what to say about that other than Jin is stupid. <laughs> stupid! <laughs> character! Stupid ass character, bro. But here we go. Big Chan making it into the grand finals with a Stupid ass character, but congratulations <laughs> to him. Jay Buckley, 500, going up against Rit next. Oh boy, and winner. I think it's actually 5,000. No, it's 500, because they can't fit thousands yeah. in there. <laughs> oh damn, I don't have like, game well, Sonic Fox's number. <laughs> All right, but we got Jay Buckley, Rip. You know, I, Rip did say earlier because they were in the pool, same pool together, right? And Rip was like, "Oh, we got, I got to play Jay Buckley, probably never got to play." But then when he lost in the loot in the winter side, he's like, "Oh, I don't get to play Jay Buckley now. Now he gets to play Jay Buckley. Do you want to play Jay, Jay Buckley now? Come you know, on up to the stream <laughs> station. No. Let's go. <laughs> Not anymore. Look, I didn't know he had these other characters. Whenever I played Jay Buckley, it's always been Steve Fox. Mm -hmm. And last time we played was at. I think Bud Light and I and I beat him up with his Steve Fox, but he beat me prior to that with Steve Fox. So I don't know what he's gonna use here. I mean, fourth is what it sounds like. His Bob looked pretty damn solid today too. You know, up against Senpai Relax. So we'll see how what character he decides to go with. You know, he did say that when he beat FDX, he said he beat FDX with his Bob, right? He said that if he played Steve, FDX would have two owed him. You know, like you little, you know, you, you know, you always gotta be like generous, and nice about that kind of stuff, right? Like, yeah, you did a good job, man. You lost to me, hey. You know that kind of stuff. <laughs> <laughs> you know, I was like, yeah, come on, man. Yeah. Don't, 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 don't patronize me like. That. But then you know, if you're in uh, Jay Buckley's shoes here. Just seeing how Rip just beat like the Bob of America right now, right? Magnificent. Does he go Bob here? I don't think so, right? I, I mean, I, the one thing one thing Rip has been saying this entire time was the last time they played, Jay Buckley did use Steve. So My, maybe mind games, maybe real talk. Who knows? I don't lose to Steve players. 
damn. Or that, Bob players anymore. The <laughs> layers are continuing. <laughs> Ever. And, and might as well throw I'm Dragon off, right. Lars, <laughs> yeah. and just put a lot of the male characters in there. You'll be fine. I don't lose, I don't lose the Tekken players. <laughs> <laughs> I only lose the Smash players. <laughs> I only lose the SpongeBob mains out here. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> God. Man, I never felt older in my I life. I can already that Twitter see that Twitter discourse about it. Like about you really game. saw how old somebody was by which Nickelodeon shows they were referencing. That's the reason why I didn't want to say anything. Cause I'm like, man, no, I don't even remember what my favorite Nickelodeon show is. But I don't. Can I play as Amanda ones. Bynes in the <laughs> Nick Smash oh, game? Shit, all that. <laughs> yeah. Oh, Keenan and Cal as, as two characters as one. Oh, dude, oh. and his super is orange soda, bro. <laughs> I'm losing my shit just thinking about that. Oh All right, my Jay God. Buckley going with the Bob, though. All right, I like that because this Bob has been looking pretty damn good today. But Rip sticking with the log because you know he ain't never switching. <laughs> this is so stupid, dude. Well, are we going to have Clarissa explains it all what, being a guest guest stage or something? <laughs> Oh, wait, you're gonna fight, it... fight! You're gonna fight in a room with that ladder guy coming up. That wait, wasn't it, wasn't that also a Nick show? Uh, Are you afraid of the dark? Yeah, yes. it was. Can't they do... <laughs> the campfire's a boss. <laughs> <laughs> All right, good combo. Oh, this is a first of two, by the way. Not a first of three. Remember, because it's not finals yet, so lose a semis. But these guys are in the money. Top four. Wow, what a duck! Just random wall setting two one from Jay Book. That hit. He's on a 17 win streak on with his That's box. the reason why you stuck with it. And nice pick up there. Got the, the float roll. as well. Rip spring kicking or forward rolling into that. Gets himself floated. Jay Bucky taking the first round. Presenting some different uh, Oki scenarios that I've never seen before. Rip definitely fell for that one. Oh, no duck on that back 2-2. Two, two. Yeah, that's a so tough one. It's a hard one to do, but if you if, if you're used to playing against Bob, especially back in the six, Tekken Six days, it's like those are the ones you do, like always try to do. Yeah, that's one thing I told myself against going up against Bob's in Tekken Six was always try to fuzzy a down forward after a single jab and back two, just in case you have to low parry a one down four or back two two. Mm -hmm. A lot of kind of far jab. Wow! Oh, oh. so too far. Rip had to readjust the combo. He had to do down four two, micro dash a four up three. Still Don't mind, the, we get another chance. Still got the count at four on Bob. It's been rage though. Two. There we go. Big boy coming. Is he gonna run it? Nope. Just four a goal to nothing. Oh, the other low, and he took the frames. That was a frame trap. Rip couldn't mash or anything. Yeah, My, Rip probably tried to mash there too, but the Jay Buckley using the frame advantage there, the two one, working out there. Nice. Big. That's the rip special. You know, Tekken 6 rip, that's what I've always known him for. Just standing in the right spot. As soon as you whip, he down four twos you. Ooh, oh, he tried. He this tried to whip tech. punish, but got too crazy with it. Yeah, tried to get to Tekken 7. He's like, all right, Tekken 6 rip, good. Tekken 7 rip, nah. Maybe not. <laughs> <No>. <laughs> Almost. Almost. Stick to six, rip. Stick to six. Uh, Jay Buckley looking super solid here right now. Just poking him out. Mm. Yeah, not a lot of damage that all can do for that. And the down back four cl closes it out. Down back four is a is a great round under two for Bob I, because he does have the follow ups afterwards, right? The mid. So if you try to block the low and try to you know punish it, the mid's gonna always clip you there. So and like and the layer even beyond that, like Ricky said, there's a third hit too. So it's mm -hmm. like you could punish the second hit if you block the low and then you block the mid. But then if you try to punish the second hit, there's a high or a low mix after that too. <laughs> so it's just like, yeah. And also the first hit is uh, not launch punishable. It used to be stagger on block, but now it's only like minus 12, 13, something like that. That was, why would that stagger on block? Well, the only stagger on block was Tekken 6. Yeah. Mm -hmm. When they decided like, all right, we'll make that low poke stagger on block, but everything else, you know, not. Nah, Dude, no and remember tag two, like when down back three plus four stop staggering? I'm just like, yes. what did, What the hell were you guys thinking? What and you had to like learn, if you really wanted to deal with it, you had to learn like the mental timing for like, okay, if I block it, then I can wait and punish it still. <laughs> it's like, it was like, because like if you did your punish right away and they did the second hit, you'd get clipped. 
Mm -hmm. But if you waited for the second hit to come out and it didn't, you still had time to like do your wall standing punish. I'm like, why is this so complicated? Why is this a, yeah, why is this even a thing? It's, it's like, stupid. Not a fucking thing. It's, fucking it's stupid. It's literally fucking stupid. Like, why it's, am I dealing with it's, this? It's, 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 no, one, no one's playing tag two right now, so it's fine. Leave it in the past. Oh it's not. God. It's not a big deal. Don't Thank worry about God. it. <laughs> Thank God. It's, it's stagger blocks now. It's okay. Oh, you're <laughs> right, Ricky. You're right. Yeah, but now I gotta do a crush dash one launch me. <laughs> oh, yeah, that part. Back. Yeah, that part sucks. Let's talk about that. And he has a fucking fifteen frame launcher <laughs> that nobody uses. Oh man, that's funny. You know, Bob is making a Bob is actually making a comeback too. Especially since you know we know that we knew about all the buffs that he got in season four, right? But then it was like everyone's like, "Oh, Bob's back." Then everyone played him was like, "Oh, Bob's dead again." No one played him again. <laughs> you know and then the now the. Bob players are coming back and playing well again. Oh yeah, god, this ugly ass Bob. Bob. <laughs> it's a big thing, ass baby. Everybody's picking the ugly outfits today. Okay, that's cool. But that's the thing with Bob, right? Like ever since they nerfed him from 6.0 to BR, and I was like, he's always gonna be good as long as he has Hell Sweep and his range. And he still has that. Yeah, you know, and even Tekken 7, right? They kind of nerfed his range too. Like his jab isn't as far as it once was, but it's you know, he's still Bob, right? He's still good yeah. with that. Oh, he went. Took the for risk it. and rip was ready. Yeah, Rip that's, a that punish punish. Yeah. that's a legacy punish. That's a legacy punish for sure. Yeah, you would have been better off doing the four Ooh. instead. Mm -hmm. Nice, oh, mate. No, oh, what is that punish, Rip? Oh, oh my okay. god, you moron! <laughs> god! You could have just done one, one, two, or uh, Rip is so Oh, there we Dude, go, though. You could have finished the first three hits of the 10 string, it's natural, you know? Like, what down for one, three, I bet you, I, I bet natural. you, my, my, oh, good duck, though. My assumption is he probably messed something up and he's gonna have a, have some sort of excuse when he comes back and he tells us about it, but right now he's finally on the board here, Rip tying it up. That was a good round for him too, making all the right reads, making all the right defensive moves, and this counter Ooh, fours are paying go. off for Rip a ton. Wall and the carry. wall, mm -hmm. perfectly goes for the easy. I like it. I like oh. it. Keeping the wall with the slide. Another one. The triple. Oh. Triple. Four. Oh, okay. He got mashed oh. up. Oh. oh, just do a fourth one. Fuck it. Wow. Just do it. No duck though. Don't do it, Rip. Don't do it. Actually, it wasn't a bad no. choice. That's a bad choice. The, oh, the toe kick wasn't even gonna kill, dog. Oh my wow. god! Wow. You know, honestly, J. Oh Buck could have done a better combo there at the wall yeah. too, right? To yeah, totally killed him. There are combo. decisions being made on both sides right now. Yeah, you know, I think J. Was, he tried to sidestep to get a re-wall splat, but it didn't work. But mm -hmm. best thing to do there is like to back up and get that up four two string. Yeah, oh, this down, back back down back two. Nice grips, unskilled. Those mid back. this time. His back's to the wall, though. That's all oh, Rip's throwing out those counter fours. He's looking for it. So scary. Counter four versus crash dash one. Ooh. <laughs> Slow on the flip, but he gets that, but the walls were close. Oh, not close Actually, enough. Not as close oh, as I thought. I love it. The... What? He got killed him. Oh, no. Why is this happening? That's not. Oh, my oh, God. Oh, my God. Guess for life. Guess for life. Oh, he took the whole body. All right, you know what? So Jay Buckley, he also did what while standing one, two, or whatever, and into down three, four. That's not a combo anymore. It's, it's not. Yeah. It used to be, but it's not anymore. He tried to make that work still, even with the wall there, but it does not work anymore. But oh my god, both of these guys, like really, just they're trying to find the hardest reads to win, right? They're not trying yeah. to win off a of solid tech. They're trying to read off of blow for blow, counter hit for counter hit. Look, it's I'm gonna- sloppable tech. Yeah. It's just <laughs> yeah. super yeah. sloppy. Yo, I need more sub ICFCs. Come on. <laughs> <laughs> <It's hard. laughs> Damn, uh, this is how he does it? Okay. We believe Rip right. just has that ability to like, bring you down to his level and beat you with experience, man. It's just, <laughs> cause really? Jay Buckley started playing, making some really weird choices on his yeah. offense in that, yeah. in that game. I mean that's what, and that's honestly what Rip does, right? Because you start to play like you start to play. Oh, okay, now oh, I got Rip. I I three owed him first game, whatever, no problem. I got this. And the Rip starts doing some stuff. You're like, wait, hold on, okay, maybe. Like, you don't know what? Screw that. No, I got this guy. Now this guy's whack. Dude, that 
<laughs> roller coaster of emotions that Ricky just explained. It happens to me every, every time, time I fight Rip. I'm just like, man, I feel like I've really improved. I've really been grinding in Tekken. I feel so <laughs> solid now. And then as soon as I start playing Rip, he's doing like flip kicks, fake flips, sliding all over the place, and hop kick. And I'm just like, shit. I guess I gotta throw out all of my fundamentals too and just do that. It yeah, you start. Work for me. It doesn't yeah, work for me. You start thinking like, oh, you you play with no fundies. I'll play with no fundies. Let's see how it works out. And then like, doesn't like, work oh, out wait. for you. Nope. That's <laughs> no, not work. That does not work. It no is a play here. style. It is a true play style. <laughs> like Rip just incepts you. He just like puts a hex on your brain. It's like, and then yeah. you're like, wait, he how did I lose? You to try wait, to is the match over? How did I lose? Him? And it's just like, you can't play like him. It's just like, you can't. <laughs> mm -mm. All right, so Rip tying it up here. Jay Buckley sticking with the Bob, not falling for the Rip, calling out his Steve. Jay Buckley, I saw in the chat room, he said he's at, he has to bury Steve for this tournament. He's not... He's not playing yeah. Steve. Shinblade was disappointed the fact that he's not playing dead Steve. <laughs> nice block. J Bucky has been blocking some of these slides, right? So he gets these combos, but is it going to be enough? Yeah, here? I don't even know if the wall sending two on does more damage than the wall sending four now. I think wall sending four is more optimal there. I feel like the, the first time he punish. first time he blocked it too, he did wall sending that. that. <laughs> That's yeah, what he's been doing. That. <laughs> While so standing all the wrong while answers. Standing <laughs> while standing all the wrong answers. Oh, nice duck. Oh, that's a good duck, though. No. no. What is happening there? What? It's the worst. What? Sai wall killed lives right there. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Dude, there's, there's no saving the, there. It's like the wall came into play right in the right amount of hits in between the string. Yeah, oh it's like per it was perfectly tailor made. That wall was made for that string right in that situation. He's using a wall standing one two a lot. He should have waited for the back three just a tad so he'd get fully grounded hit. Jay Buck is like ducking a lot. Himself. When Rip finally commits, he's coming with jabs and Jay yeah, Buck is just like ducking. Or Rip oh. dashes up into like range one and then hits four, trying to fish for a magic four right now. This guy's playing four three crack. plus four that make it hurt. Dragon tail that. Working really hard for these rounds here. Rip got the pressure with the wall. Oh, the oh, hot no kills. Jesus, take the wheel! <laughs> the hardest freeze. The time. You know, watching Rip play patient is so weird to me now. It makes me feel so anxious. All right. Like, I don't, oh my god! Like, when is he gonna fuck this? it up? Where's the jump scare? Where's the jump scare? Oh. All right, Jay Buckley. Two rounds here. One more round, and he advances to top three. We're just gonna need a miracle here, or just solid, better solid tech in play. It's not oh, all yeah. these slides Long are not. Range slide, nice <laughs> but that's the thing, J Buck is not punishing him so hard for these slides. So Rip's yeah, not... but Rip keeps yeah, going to it a little too. It's still obviously. consistent. Yeah. yeah, he's still going to it a little too obviously. Still gotta Rip... mix it up. There's the mix. He had it. Considering how many wall setting twos he did on Marduk, he hasn't really done any on Bob. <laughs> right. And does he even have the right punish for it? The punish is a little weird for Bob. He can launch it, but he has to know it. Oh, but he got the count in four finally. He's been looking for that. Here, though. Probably? No, he still hits side. Wow. Oh my god! Got the count in no! the back turn two. No! How does he do it? She the combo! No! No! Okay, good thing he did while standing 2 1. He left you live. He let you live! Calm down. Oh. No, wow. Bad for the mid this time. Risked it all on everything, but Jay Buckley moving on to the top three there. Rip ending his tournament at fourth place. A respectable fourth place, Good but run. a fourth Good place run. nonetheless. Nice job though. Jay Buckley moving on, you know, showing off that Bob, man, looking real good. Nice but... stuff with the Bob. <laughs> but oh, the Bob's looking nice. Yeah, it was getting kind of crazy in that last game, but that's going to be our losers finals coming up. Jay Buckley advancing to solidify his top three placing. Can he move on further, though? He has to go up against Joey Fury next, and this is no small opponent to look down upon. Joey Fury's been killing it out here, and then if you get past him, you have to worry about being checked. Yeah, not to like discredit the rest of the field or Jay Buckley's chances in this next match. The two guys right now in Grand mm -hmm. and Losers Finals, they are a cut above everybody else. So right now, this is a big difficulty jump for Jay Buckley going into this next match. Yeah, for sure. And I mean, especially considering that if Jay Buckley tries to run the Bob, you know, he's Joey's probably well versed with that matchup, right? Playing against Mac all the time. So, you know, I think that 
the Bob, I mean, but the thing is that he definitely plays Bob differently, right? So, you know, you can you can always utilize that, but I think Jay Buckley's just gonna have to play the best he can, you know, because, you know, Joey's not gonna, Joey's no slouch. Hey, how's it going, Hey, Rip? good job being a fourth. Do it. Thanks, man. Uh, it's no, nice. that was good. No, actually, the thing that got me there was he adapted big time from the last sets we played. Because like the slides before, he would let me do all of them, and then I was trying to force the mix up. So that time I was like, I was like, is he really not gonna let me do any? And so I was confused, you know. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, wait, man, what's happening? Did he I really was... learn that much? No, it's like... really fast, right? Like this was on Monday, so it's only been two days, you know. So it's uh, it's, it's big changes. Good, it's good stuff, Jay Buckley. Good luck. Can man. people really get better that quickly? But I mean, you uh, gotta. I mean, he is though. But you have to remember though, he was playing Steve against you that last time, right? Yes, but still, probably, like, probably more, but probably know, like more options. willing, but probably more willing to duck with Bob because you know Bob's wall standing options are so good in this right. thing. Yeah. So. Yeah. yeah, especially at that range too. All yeah. do all Bobs are like kind of ducking for that wall standing two one, anyways. Yeah, yeah. No, it was good. It was good. I enjoyed the game. Here we go. The losers final. Whoa! Hey, Buckley, the back dash? All right, gets the big combo here. Side roll nice. from Joey though. Yep, you gotta be prepared for that. That's what you like to see. You might as well go for it. You Yo, might as well go for it. Yeah, you don't lose time. anything by going for yeah. it. Okay, so yeah, go Joey going with the Fang again. This is the character that you would bring nice, out against the mini uh, combo. It's the character you would bring out against Max Bob. Mm, yeah, and the Mac decided to be a Devil Jin main after that. <laughs> the hell sweet. The movement's looking good for Jay Buckley. Wow. The, challenge. Oh, the challenge after that, Joey not scared. And that's crazy because down back through his 4 4, you're hella plus. Yeah. But then Jay Buckley. Wow! It's nice side step on the trip. Hey, maybe Jay Buckley, you should be a Mishima main, man. What the hell are you doing? Oh, <laughs> yeah. Sidestep. He's like, nah, man. Bob's more brain dead. More <laughs> nice brain dead, but he's doing this like execution intensive punishes right here. Right? Uh -huh. It's funny because he doesn't do anything like to his Steve, you know? Like obviously Steve has with Bob combos, is really yeah. nice too. He got the wave mm -hmm. wave moves down. He got the Oof. back dashes. But Joey's getting these whip punishes. Joey's playing more songs. Wow! Than wow. Ballroom dance. Do oh. see no spin Take your partner it, to and fro. Take it and give it a what? <laughs> that was oh, the windmills! That was so sick. The god. Hey. This is why I hate walls with funky ass corners. <laughs> yeah. it, man. That's why I love it. it. That's why I love them. That's why when somebody tells me, yeah, I like Mishima Dojo, it's like a perfect square and nothing weird happens. No, I look, not. I give him a side eye, like, <laughs> <laughs> it's like, mm. those corners, walls? Did you just see what just happened? Yeah, you know, perfect square. You know, every square has eight sides. <laughs> All right, Joey well, taking it 3 0, though, very fast first game there. Jay Buckley had a lot of opportunities, it felt like, but just didn't capitalize on any of them so yeah it started off pretty good right like that mm -hmm. initial first round back dash low parry i was like oh he's looking good here and then joey's like holding on to every single round i was like damn joey just had one setup for every single situation i was like oh yeah i'm gonna win this i'm gonna win this too oh you i'm pl you're plus like two million while standing <laughs> one two i'll float you whatever no big deal the uh <laughs> the start of the round windmill too i was like what the hell like who does that with fang that was crazy <laughs> you know like that move like to me is like only existed in Tekken 6 when it was a when it was a tech trap. Tech trap but, yeah. but now seeing it being like a real like move that's a hit confirmable launcher is like I don't like it. <laughs> yeah, making it hit confirmable now actually made it so much better. It's like you actually see uses for it now. Yeah, I mean, yeah, it's, at, it's, at that it's range, elegant. we were talking about those slower options when he was playing Bing Chain. Like he didn't try doing windmills, mm -hmm. and even though it is slow, you can try and hit confirm it, so that uh, reduces the risk of getting punished for doing it. I know it's one of those strings too. It's like it's kind of scary to even like try to whip punish, right? Because if they could just, yeah, they might just throw out the second hit just yeah, on whip. Why, right? why would I put my hand in the blender like that? It's yeah, like, it's like <laughs> it's scary, right? So you gotta kind of let him just swing his arms around and then just like you know, it's like a baby that's mad. You know, ten, 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 temper tantrum. Yeah, same like, thing when he's like running down back twos. It's like yeah, he's just like all right, all right, he's pissed, but let him let him tie himself out. He, <laughs> you know, he'll 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 calm down eventually. Yeah, just give him his milk. He did, I, right before J Buckley played you, Rip, he said he had to bury the Steve for this tournament. And now mm -hmm. Steve got <laughs> dug out the grave for Joey. Yeah. Joey, get, you out of <laughs> get out of the fucking grave, man. <laughs> I'm going to kill you again. <laughs> I mean, obviously, Joey, he has a lot of Bob experience, right? I mean, I'm sure he has a ton of Steve experience, too, but... Uh, I think Steve versus Fang sounds easier to me. <laughs> oh, my God. That looked, that looked much easier. Yeah. <laughs> Jay Buckley, that's like a special for him, man. Round start back one, and it hits. It hit oh, me. God. 
<laughs> Were you using Steve too? I was using Ball. Oh gosh. Joey swinging, though, not waiting. Doesn't want to play defensively. This is how it's went, right? Big lead for Jay Buckley, Joey to come back, but not this time running too. Jay Buckley's instant running too. That's one of the big trademarks of his Steve, actually. A lot of running two pressures. Yeah, and he's good at it, like Ooh. right in your face. Yeah, this yeah. matchup has always been interesting in Tekken because Fang's always been pretty good. Even when Steve was like super top tier, he's always been pretty good at trying to keep Steve in check and yeah. the, in the close up game. Like back one, back four, punch parry, stuff like that. Just making yep. Steve not want to be super crazy. And a lot of really good high crush options yeah. and also the punch parry Shibaki as well. Uh, but this matchup is very interesting because people say like, oh yes, I've heard it both ways. Steve is a good matchup for Fang, and I heard Fang is a good matchup against Steve. It's, it's definitely a skill matchup. Like yeah. both players have to like figure out each other's tendencies. I, and habits. I definitely think this matchup is five five, but it's a very fun five five because like Fang wants to do like down back threes, down two, and then all these things that I crush Steve all day to kind of deter him from doing back one all day. Yeah, exactly. Yep. Back one versus down two. But then if Steve blocks or low parries low, it hurts. So it's like that payoff is pretty. Interesting. That's a close game here. Oh, oh, he tried to mix up. Wow, Joey just standing in his face, blocking. No, ooh, big whip punch. I like that. Jay yeah, Buckley was threatening with those flicker jabs too, but J Joey Fury just staying patient. Big calls. One, one, two of them during the transition of the back temple to the forward temple. Yeah, that's another thing. Like in this matchup, like unless somebody messes up bad, it's gonna be a lot of little punishes at a time. Like it's. Like, neither character can super badly punish the other on block. Yeah. Yeah. Wow. Right. Unless you go for something like that! Oh! oh. Setting up for OT, got the spike. Five point combo! Yeah, take a five? Yeah. I'm sick! Oh, oh man! Well no combo! Nice! Just, Just enough, enough. the last hit! Wow! That was a good combo too, right? Because I think he tried to do something to re-wall splat, but noticed that it was going to hit the wall anyway. So he's like, I know what can combo after this, even if it's too close. And it was, but he did the right combo. The massage, he killed him. So ties it up 1-1. One, one. Ooh. Hey, Buckley, man. Looking he's good, man. Box. Yeah, he's looking great today. And you know, I was talking about how like you see a lot of the execution when he's playing the Bob, like with the wave moves and everything. But really, I forgot about the instant running attacks from his Steve. You know, there there were hints in there that I wasn't really paying attention to. Attention to. So this is really cool to see him uh, taking on Joey here. One one. Uh, I mean, anything can happen. And why is Joey not using Marduk? Like, what is the reasoning for him bringing out Marduk? I'm still thinking about why he picked it on me. I wanted to play the Fang. You know what I'm saying? Because he wanted why? to beat you. <laughs> Damn it. Well, if he's expecting the Bob, the Fang is what he would normally play on Max Bob, so maybe he thought it'd be the same thing. Uh, now that he's lost to the Steve, I mean, Fang is still a pretty good pick against uh, Steve. Marduk, Steve versus is kind of annoying for Marduk because you I just bet. get mashed on all day. Yep. But Marduk. Marduk, has to, Marduk is Marduk, and yep, one good Marduk's read, Marduk. one good high crush can like delete Steve's life bar. That's the thing with Steve versus Marduk though. Like, Marduk can spam down one plus two against him. Right? Yeah. Because unless Steve is stepping it, uh, if you're going for jabs or back one, Marduk can just freely go for down one plus two because it's minus 12. And with a little bit of pushback, and Steve's 12 frame just isn't there for that range. He can't punish the down one plus two more often than not. And that's a really good move to not be able to punish in this matchup mm -hmm. yep. before the usage of the high crush and it's a launcher. Round one. Well, let's see here. Fight. The beautiful outfit for Marduk, of course. Mishima building gets the tackle start of the round. Hey. That little fuzzy that Joey does after the tackles hit. Like the sidestep right, Valley two to cancel, or it looks like he low parries after. It's so interesting. Hmm. It nullifies all the getup kicks if you try to do it. Do anything. Wow. No punish. Oh, he runs into the launcher. Classic. Calling on his jack instincts, yeah. He's dead, yeah. And yeah, this matchup, you know, like you said, Mike, uh, he's got oh. the down plus two right there. No. <laughs> it's just. It's, it's just Marduk waiting for one opportunity to delete your life bar, take him to the wall, yeah, exactly. and run and this. And then you get tackled, and then it's pretty much the round. I mean, that's funny too, right? You said Jay Buckley, the special Jay Buckley is the back one hitting at the beginning of the round, but 
one of the Joey specials is to do shoulder at the beginning of the round. <laughs> so true. And, and so that, that straight up beats Jay Buckley's option. Oh, he could have done yeah, it again. Five there. too, yeah. Oh, Ooh. I like that. All right, nice. Dunk him. Damn, I want an option like that. What? You have like five. <laughs> better one. <laughs> better one. <laughs> nice <bucks>. combo. <laughs> that great. This isn't right. better than your hot kicks or your yeah, it is. Hot... My hot kick always turns Marduk upside down for some reason. <laughs> you hella not doing it at the right time, dude. <laughs> yeah. You're catching him during the airborne part. <laughs> See, because Steve, Steve's works perfectly. It just beats him at the right time. <laughs> <laughs> Perfect. Oh, nice. Got the Sonic Bang into the wall splat. Nice. Jay Buckley not going out here. He's fighting back. Joey content to just wait. Oh, oh, and then get punched oh, in the face. Yeah, Jay Bucky finally felt that Joey was going to get impatient there and oh, caught him with that back wall, one. Though, doesn't want to overcommit for the damage. Breaks nice through. Break. That's a break. Nice choices there. Jay Buckley fighting back now ties up the set. Fight. Mm -hmm. Oh, yeah. Nice. Good reaction to that. Yeah, That's what everybody should be doing to it. Yeah, the mid-range tackle like that, you could put yourself airborne before the hit actually comes in. Unfortunately, it would have... <laughs> yeah, I thought it timed like it. That like, I thought it would just hit that at the right timing. Yeah, I thought it was perfect every time. <laughs> I have a Joey. Playing patient, oh, nice. there's a flow. Wrong pickup, though. He had two oh, while setting one. Not the Yo. one. Mini combo. A lot of damage so fast. That forward one. Oh, the running two pressure. What the? Oh, oh one, two, one. Two, one. Nice, Jay Buckley. Buckley. The fuck? Putting, putting the pressure on Joey, right? Joey f tried to fight back, right? But Jay Buckley's like, no, 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 you ain't got no time. He came back. He came back from that down 2-0. Yeah. That was sick, actually. Uh, the running was really pressure good because... into rocket launcher. I love that, too, because the back was towards wall, so it was like a pure mix. Mm -hmm. nice. And I really like, uh, you, you would have thought that maybe that one down, th one plus two from Joey would have been enough to dissuade uh, Jay Buckley from being as aggressive. But both times, like, at those round in situations buckley was mashing on like no you don't get to do anything right now it's like mashed him I'm, out of rage drive in the previous round mash him at the end right there if you ever get a steve player to get off a of back one that'll be like the best day of your life <laughs> because there's no way any that steve player <laughs> is never gonna press back one if you ever play a steve player they don't press back one you just gotta be like bro do you, you know this move is good <laughs> yeah, do you know what are you doing <laughs> If you nullify his back one to that point, it's just like, why are you even playing Steve? Anymore? Yeah, <laughs> yeah. At that point, that point, just play a better character. You ain't playing no Steve if you're not using back one. <laughs> I mean, he's doing a really good job of shutting down the tackle, though, right? Like, yeah, that, it's it's basically deleted it from the moveset. Like, I think Joey landed a couple, but overall, the longer that set went on, the more the upward twos were stopping him. I mean, the, Joey couldn't use that as his mid-range, like, uh, you know, closing option, right? So a lot of times you saw that Joey just stood there, right? Just waiting, waiting, waiting. And then he tried to go for a counter hit, like, homing attack. And that's when Jay Buckley hit him with that back one. So, like, you know, he tried to play more patient and try to outpatience him, but didn't work out there. So Joey now going to Arctic Snowfall here. All right, here we go. And Joey Shh. likes these infinite stages. He doesn't feel like he doesn't like getting cornered. It feels like by Marta. Like if he gets somebody to the wall, that's nice. But more often than right. not, he's like getting cornered in these uh, games. Wow. Hey. hey. Mm, that hurts. Oh god! He, he did try to do it. You saw him jump up a little bit. Oh, finally with the low parry. Someone Dude, finally. Dude, Joey's that. layers after the whole tackle break or tackle hit is so counter good. hit. Whoa. Why is Whoa. it safe too? Yeah, and it wall splats on normal hit. <laughs> what? I didn't know that part. That's cheap. Oh yeah, Joey <laughs> with, with the shoulder. Oh nice. I like the duck. If he did duck two, that would have been so sick. Look at these running attacks. Push him around. Nice. I love it. Right, I'm back with the jabs. Yeah, the pressure from both players utilizing oh, each other. That's, That's a launch. launch. Damn. Uh, running the two, running two. Getting him over the tackle. Got to deal with this one, though. That was a meaty one. Mm -hmm. 
was a good timing for Joey there. Yeah, these are the ones Joey can get away with. You know, I, I think Joey, because he hasn't been getting punished for these tackles as badly as that first one, he's yep. not scared Ooh, to throw that one. Wow. He waited. Wow. He hated he that it one. out. He, oh. he canceled the VTS so that he could just let it rip oh. and whip punish. That was godlike. That, was that is crazy. so smart. Next level. That was crazy. <laughs> Just raw VTS, let him win. Oh, my God. God. Look at this. What do you yeah, think he's going to do? Faking him out. Now he's faking him out. Dunk one mini cobble didn't get it. Yo, don't count him out, though. Buckley can make this comeback still. Yeah, Steve's a great character, and so is Jay Buckley. He's a great player. But yeah, right Jay now, Buckley Joey has the lead, too. This is hard to come back on Steve Ugh. like this. He's a wall. Oh, Unless you get a tackle. <laughs> I broke it, though. Marduk's the real wall. Oh no, no sir. He took been wishing out like her. He's taking to the airs too much. He's taking a page out of Rift Storm. He's trying. That's a problem. He's, he, he, <laughs> that's a problem. <laughs> oh, oh no, it wasn't counter. Like it wasn't counter. Yeah, nice, nice adjustment there from Joey too. Damn. That was yeah. a really sick adjustment. Like, yeah. That was a that was a super smart idea from Joey. Just think, because like BTS sometimes, yeah, sometimes you gotta <laughs> test people because like sometimes when sick. people react consistently to certain things, you gotta be like, okay, is this guy actually doing on a reaction or is he reacting to a tell of something yeah. else? Yeah, and then he found out that he's just reacting to him going into BTS. Is he's not actually yeah. reacting to the tackle part? So he was yeah. like, okay, shoot, let me just take yeah. that. I'm going into tackle by faking oh. out BTS. In that situation, did Jay Buckley do an up two instead of up four? Yeah. It looked like he did, looked like he did up two. Now. He's doing yeah. up two a lot. Yeah. That sucked. Yeah, because if he had moved forward, I think he would have at least got a block, maybe. But man, that was such a nice, nice adjustment there from Joey too. I mean, damn, man, it's because like you know, if the the adjustments going back and forth are so so sick here. So it's like, what does Jay Buckley do differently? You know, like. It's it feels like he's playing this as well as he can, right? But now the tackle mind game is a little bit not in his favor because he's gotten punished for trying to punish the tackle, you know? So mm -hmm. he's got to think about going for something a little safer to try to yeah. punish it, or maybe just, you know, not try to go for so such a hard read on the punish. I don't know. It's like, there's or a maybe lot go of back to Bob. Or yeah, you know, Bob's, maybe Bob's not choice. even, maybe not even up forward two, because you know how like that one time he got the up forward two and it spiked him instead, just mm -hmm. up forward one. If it's uh, for tackle, because if it does spike him, you'll get like a free course of forward two if you get an airborne. Yep. And Stay safer. with Steve. Safer I like this up or two. Uh, and it's final game here, right? 2-2 two, two set, I think. Yep. yep. All tied up. This is it. Yeah, thank you guys all for joining us. I know it's been a long night because we had the Steam maintenance stuff that was happening earlier, but it's been pretty well, good the last well. couple hours. Oh, well, wow. cross, knock on wood, cross our fingers. I know. Oh, oh my god. The Joey down special. Four into down forward one. That sequence. Like, the sequence. You better tech. You better oh, tech god. or I'm going to flip your ass. Oh man, he tried Why to do it again. Do oh, he grounded. I don't know, but I like it. <laughs> I hate it. <laughs> it would hit grounded, but not consistently. So stupid. <laughs> <laughs> man, this is the MYK complaining hour. I know. I love it. Mike's gonna have his own new podcast. <laughs> stupid <laughs> podcast. <laughs> Everything I hated. Oh, oh again. Oh, you brought it out again. Stupid down one plus two. <laughs> I mean, we all knew that it was an option there. Oh, now Ford made like it. That was not working. I like it. He's listening. He's Faster a listener. He's oh, down forward two is better, two. too. Oh, he had it. He no. wanted so much more damage out of that. He's so green. Yeah, I mean, he's what? getting it, though. Yeah. yeah. I no, respect it. Off the wall. Oh, damn. Uh, oh, God. This is terrifying. Oh, oh no. 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 Marduk. That sucks because Steve sidewall, he can still get Sonic Fang. He he went for jabs, but yeah, if you go was, for jabs, you can go for one two one. One two one always works on sidewalls. I, I think so he was trying. There. I think he was Take trying to maybe try to, maybe try to like yeah. scrape him off the wall yeah. with double jab, and it just but didn't, it didn't work out. Need it. Yeah, he You're didn't right. need it. What? Jumping one mic that's he told him to do? <laughs> <laughs> Not that one. I know. I know. <laughs> <laughs> the down for two is working pretty good here against Sack. Hey. Or against BTS. I would have got one there. The the issue with those, uh, even he's going for these hard reads on the VTS, but nothing's paying out. And right there, the tackle finally. Yeah, ever since, tackle, ever since Joey baited that one up two with a tackle, yeah, the tackle's, the tackle's been back working in so much more now. It's hella back in play. And if you don't break the one plus two throws, you're eating a free 77 damage. Oh no! <laughs> no. And now those for the reads, yeah, the reads. Last oh, chance, Jay Buckley. 
Otherwise, it's gonna be Joey. Oh, that was an damn. opportunity. Damn, Joey, getting was, crazy. Okay, dude, that's the Buffalo jab right there. That's the Buffalo, Buffalo jab. Buffalo jab, no slash kids, you know? Yeah. Mm -hmm. Nice job there, Joey taking it and going to the grand finals to go up against Ben Chang. Jay Buckley out in third place. Nice showing, nice showing. Yeah, good stuff, Jay Buck. Uh, Joey Fury, though, moving on. Guaranteed a top two finish. And but he's got dude, a rough you one. Guys paid? Yeah, he does. Ben Chang Rock, has man. been looking Great, real strong today. Uh, you know something I would do against tackle? Just saying. I'd jump back. <laughs> but I, what I you know, that do. doesn't work as well anymore because of you that hit. Because yeah. it has that, that hit, hit fucks now. everything up, dude. But you, I, that's the reason yeah. you can't do you can't do it too close. You have to be at a range where jump. You know, jump back's gonna at least avoid all the tackles. So yeah, hard. I got a new thing I want to try. What about jumping forward? What, just have him go under you? Yeah, have him go under. And since he has that can spear part at the end of the tackle, maybe he's like super recovering and then he could run up junkyard on his back or something. No way. Dude, if that I'm, works, I will bro, I'll be very happy. Test it for I'm me. I'm going to look at that. Yeah. Uh, all right, guys. Grand final set one. Bin Chang versus Joey Fury. See it on your screen. You guys can place your bets now. Of course, last time they did it, it was Bin Chang that won it 3 0. With the gin. So keep that in mind. Yeah, with the gin Kazama. Mm -hmm. Place your bets. And of course, guys, you guys are watching ICFC, the Intercontinental Fight Club. This is brought to you by Astro, the official headset and mix amp of the Intercontinental Fight Club. Huge shout out to Astro for always supporting us out here. Uh, we've been doing this now for eight months straight, basically. So a huge shout out to Astro for supporting us all this time. Plus, we've also got Hitbox Arcade supporting the match. We know, guys, take control. Hitboxarcade.com slash ICFCT. Boom, we are in there. Thank you very much, Hitbox Arcade. The match Reno up to $300 right now. Boom, Ortho with the Ooh. 50. Brooklyn Ninja with the two. Chris Seg with the 50. Ortho with another 50, damn. Wow, thanks, Ooh. Ortho. Plus, we had um, Hitbox, of course, another 100. Tasty Steve right now with the radio chat. Make some noise. We got hella noise in the chat. Yeah, damn. damn. Look at those emotes. Hella emotes, man. Oh, my goodness. Yeah, there's an L U I G noise now, so you guys can see more Tasty Steve. <laughs> <laughs> um, but yeah, this has been a crazy turn for you guys just joining us. It is time for the Grand Finals right now. The first set of Grand Finals incoming. Uh, we'll see Joey Fury coming from losers. Bin Chang on the winner's side. Joey will need, of course, to win two sets to win the tournament. A lot yeah. on the line. And it's going to be a tough one, though, because Bin Chang did 3-0 him earlier and with the yeah. Jin of all characters, too. It looked like the Jin was definitely the, the the reasoning as to why Joey was struggling, right? And MRK said earlier, like, that's the, that's the character that Bin Chang won with in the past tournament using Jin against Joey, so... Uh, I don't know if Joey's gonna want to switch characters or just switch a play style. Maybe he might even... I'm, I I want to see him go back. I, go back to the good old days of... Jack? Jack? Oh, gosh, come on. I was like, is this... Is he really gonna say what I think he's gonna say? <laughs> I, just, I'm, I just, you know, I'm, I want to I want to see chaos, you know? I mean, I any, that any, would be you could have said Paul, too, and I would have been like, the good old days of Paul, huh? No, I don't want to... Deleting I, life bars. Yeah but, yeah, but Paul, I think, is a, is a much more likely choice, which is why I, watched, I said oh, Jack, because yeah. I'm trying to I'm trying to go... I, for, I think I think he's saving the Jack for offline Tekken. That's my theory. Like, he's, he's got the timing. He's just, he's not, he's not going to touch every, he can put everything else online timing, but the Jack, he's never, you know, you never no, see I think, online. I think Jack is dead, dead. I think it's like that. You that think Jack, so? I think oh, Jack damn, is rusted. Damn. I think he, the damn. Jack is no longer a character. That the would be a I sick say, character, oh. bro. Dude, in Tekken 8, they should have Jack 7. And then he should just be really <laughs> rusted, rusted and old. Damn. Yeah. <laughs> you do down forward two, you lose your arm. <laughs> yeah, like Bolts squeaking. Fall out. <laughs> <laughs> I was like, what well, prototype Jack basically was, right? <laughs> yeah. Prototype Jack tight. was real shiny for being a prototype. Yeah. I mean, he's, he had a cool hat, too. Like, why, why does a prototype get the hat, but the real Jack doesn't? Yeah, and he had the spinning arms and stuff. Yeah. That shit was tight. The drill arms? Mm-hmm. Right, Jack's well, sticking with the gin like we expected. Joey's sticking, sticking with the Fang, though. Yeah, interesting. Last Jack time he is... lost with uh, Fang and Twisted Marduk. Jack is more gun jack now. He has all these bullets coming out of him and shit. Yeah, he's definitely gun jack. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I forgot. I forgot there was no Jack three. It was just gun jack. Well, yeah. Mm -hmm. There was no Jack four either. Yeah. Yeah. When's AR? Well, there jack? was, but not in the game. That's true. Yeah. They should make gun jack too. <laughs> yeah, why not? Cool. Yeah, or P jack too. <laughs> I don't know, something about Gun Jack 2 just sounded incredibly ridiculous. <laughs> like, it's like, it's like it's that's a, a dumb name. It's a sequel to Gun Jack 1, man. We all love that. Plug Jack X from uh, Cross Tekken. Oh, gosh. 
That would be pretty neat though, but I like that it stayed in cross decking like that. That was a really cool way they did that. Because off the numbering system for the pre in the Jack the Current game, they're like, all right, cross decking, X. Jack X. Yeah. That's tight, yeah, that is cool. Keeping up with tradition. It was X and not cross. Jack Cross. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I don't know. It was Street Fighter X checking. <laughs> That's what some people call it for sure. Oh my god, nice whip putters with the LLRK, I guess. What? Oh. 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 A real Jin, what a parry! Yeah! What did he try to do? He dashed forward for it. I think he wanted to block a slide or something. Maybe, maybe he thought the tackle was going to come out. I don't know. Weird. Yeah, super weird. Vin Chang not playing too hot right now. Joey looking good with the thing. I was hoping Vin Chang would, would have beat Joey so I could have suggested Ganryu, but I don't look at that this, like that's going to happen anytime soon. Wow. Good low parry, though. Yeah, he looked for like three times before Andrew be looking at it. Yeah. All right, stepping in the right direction. Big whiff doesn't try to punish it too big. Ooh, electric pressure. That's what got Binchang a lot of those wins in that first set they had. Is all those electrics started the rounds off. It yeah, looks like Joey's just tightening up his movement a lot more from the last set. Not getting clipped as often. Oh, what? Oh. He tried to jump oh my into God. the air? <laughs> because he did 3 4 and Again? bottom what? during that part. Time. Wow, he actually finished it? Yeah, it's <laughs> I mean, that's but but the fact that Vinci didn't even get the kill there is like, oh boy, <laughs> come on, you could have launched them, but he was like, just lost any four back dash. All right, Joey with the pressure here, gonna nice. get punished for that. Man, two four is so it. good. Hell yeah! Oh god, <laughs> you knew you knew as soon as you started complimenting Jin. <laughs> In my case, I had to come in there with the stupid character. He's fucking <laughs> stupid, bro. He's fucking everything. <laughs> Oh, nice oh, combo, combo too. There you go. Oh, he has the corner pressure, but he backs off. Does I want don't to feel him? good about Ben Chang here. I'm actually kind of scared. Oh, no, I'm not you say it. Mike, <laughs> Dude, this do is that why. That's I what, felt it. I, I agree. I agree. As soon as I said he backed off, I was like, why though? You know, you had the round. But you still He's not dead. Oh, oh my God. Wow. Yeah, you know, I think honestly, Ben Chang backed off because he was scared too, right? But he let Joey <laughs> get in and mix him up. And that's the reason why he lost, right? He could have kept the pressure there at the wall, you know, maybe with some down forward ones or something. But instead, he decided to back off and let Joey get back into it. And the side step forward was the one thing I was like, that's going to hit. If he yeah. does it, it's going to hit. Yeah. He dashed up in his grill, did it. And he's just Ben Chang just like, what? Yeah. <laughs> and like, that's the thing with these guys, right? They're like a cut above the rest, but it's like, you see how quickly Joey Fury understood like the pacing of that match right then and there. He's like, oh, you're backing up? Time for mix. Now's <laughs> the time, you know? Other than that, we're playing small tech in the entire yep. time, but it's like, this is the time. I got to pull it out now. Other times, you know, you see other players that are trying to get into the top eights and stuff. They try to force it too much, you know, myself included. I'm just like, I got to do the mix. I got to make a comeback. I got to do something here, even though there's 15 seconds left on the clock. I should have done that at five, you know, mm -hmm. instead of do it at 15. Little things like that. Yeah, but nice job, Joey, there making that comeback. Kind of, I guess, because Joe, it felt like more like rather than him making that comeback, Vin Chang just kind of like allowed him to come back. He's like, hey, yeah. hey come on, come on, <laughs> come on, hit me. Just that one moment of weakness by backing out. It yeah. was like that la little lack of confidence. I mean, maybe he wanted, he's scared of getting hit by the counter hit, you know, get up three or something, but he just let him back into it. So uh, we'll see what Bin Chang does here, what the, what the adjustment is. Going to go to Souk, obviously. It's a good, it's a good adjustment there. We just felt like, like offensively, Bin Chang struggled to get started, whereas Joey was just kind of, you know, his defense was so much better in this game, in this set than the first one. <laughs> Down for two two. All right, Joey, keeping the pressure on with these jabs now. Wow! wow. Oh. Electric one. I mean, he caught he Ben Chang called him out on that. You thought you were blocking this hell sweep, huh? Mm -hmm. You think this this long slow ass wave dash is gonna go into a hell sweep? Wow! That's that size of four. Yeah, that one two hit him out of it though. Small lead for wow. Ben Tank. Joey going Daniel. in the back turn. Oh no, what was he doing? Best of the combo, unfortunately. Oh, the jump. Oh, that's fine. Oh, 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 oh
What is happening? What is happening? No, oh my God. <laughs> <draw. laughs> Oh uh, man, if Vincek was a real Jin player, he might have had a combo like a jab into the Rage Art at the for a wall combo that yeah. might have killed. That whole sequence was gross. Oh, yeah, a lot of those things. From both I mean, that's the, that's the one thing we always criticize Vincek about, right? Too many characters so, can sometimes hurt you because you don't yeah. know the optimal stuff for a lot yeah. of Yeah, and it's, squeezing especially out when, like the extra five could have got him around yeah. or two. Mm -hmm. so many especially times. when the difference between optimal and not optimal is, is winning the round. Yeah. yeah. That's happening a lot. A lot. Yeah, even right there, he could have gone for like a sidestep off the side and go for 3 1, 1 2 4. Or he could have just sidestep 1 2 4 right away. Like, there was many, many ways to get more damage. There. Oh, got clipped there. You know, one thing though that I think he does like in this matchup is that 14 frame wall standing too. Oh, it's great. Yeah. Also, does nullify Fang from doing crash dash 1 and down back 3 if he blocks him. Trying to get that wall bounce Save in. high wall bounce, oh. why not? Or no, no. Too far. Too yeah. far, and that should be oh, the best. Oh. Chance, chance okay. for Vinche. Huge chance. Oh boy. One electric. Oh, one oh, block. That's it with the right combo. Woo hoo, okay. scary Keep combo. That yeah. was that was so scary. I thought it that back was. two one was going to hit the wall. Yeah, I thought it was going to yeah. be closer, yeah. That oh, was scary, I was man. like shocked that he didn't finish that string. I was like, what? why would you go back to one there? But all right. Stays alive in this game here. Wow. Try to step the running three, but no dice. Oh, hit. Well, a couple of parries in this scenario coming out of Jin would have helped him a ton. Yeah, I don't think he's comfortable with these parries. You know, he's not he's not necessarily a Jin player, right? So no, well, not, not, not right now. That's the beauty about Jin's parries, man. Like, even if you miss it, you have auto block for like 20 something frames for no reason because he's so good. Say it, you know. <laughs> <laughs> so good. good. <laughs> you, you said good like stupid. <laughs> Yo, Gosh. Joey. What the fuck? What? 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 Tech catch, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Just caught Binchek sleeping on behind the wheel right there. Damn. I know he even tech too. Yeah, that's too low. He tech uh -oh. too. He's like, uh, this combo might miss. So I'll tech, and then it's like, no, I'll still get hit though. It's no that was deal. a weird ass game, dude. That was like the weirdest game I think I've ever seen in ICFC, <laughs> especially in Grand Between Finals. Between these two, especially, yeah. right? Yeah, that yeah, was lots a of funky stuff. Woo. Yeah, Joey's not. Joey's looking, you know, a little, little, little weird here with the drop combos. But Benjay's not even capitalizing on a lot of these things, right? A lot I mean, of like. These to be fair, it's later than normal because oh, yeah. it's 1.30 for Joey right now on the East Coast, so. Way later than we usually, I mean, usually by now we're wrapped up essentially. Yeah. Uh, so, and this might be a reset still, right? So, it's a might long Might be one night of those long here. nights here for yeah, uh, Thank for you Joey. guys all for joining us tonight. It's been a it's been a hard one to watch, I feel like. If I was a spectator, I would have been like, all right, I'm going to go check some other shit come out and maybe come back later. You yeah, know? tonight was a little bit of a blow up, you know, big shout out to Steam. They're so mm -hmm. great. Thanks, team maintenance. You hit us right at the right time. Mm -hmm. On a Wednesday. Yeah, Come as usual. Yeah. <laughs> it's all good. It's all good. Things are working out. Uh, still Joey and Bin Chang here in Grand Finals. Bin Chang, if you guys missed it earlier, got him 3-0 in the winner's final. Uh, with the same exact matchup here, Jin versus Fang. I love watching these two play. It's like there's so much data on each other and there's so much like history behind each other on these online tournaments now that like the lore of like which character to pick and the matchup and stuff, it's like evolving between these two. And it's really, it's really interesting because like you said, I feel like I feel like all of the data these two have on each other is from online tournaments. I don't right, know if yeah. these two have played each other offline before. Mm -hmm. wow. Not that I could recall at all. That's I'm something I never considered and that is ridiculous. Oh, no wasn't close enough. Unfortunate. Oh. I feel like Bin Chang is getting less and less optimal. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> because nice. because yeah. Joey, just, <laughs> we talked about we, we talked about all those good Fang moves. He's just Joey's starting to sprinkle in more and more as time goes on. Yeah, and like definitely what I noticed in this set, starting it off too, Joey just came out way more patient than the first set that he played in the winners final, where he just Ooh. ran into electric beginning of the round. Safe yep. mid wall bounce. Why not? You're gonna get the wall combo here. You're gonna do a little damage here with the rage art. I feel like a wall combo would have done the same much. The same amount. Oh, yeah. Yeah. And then... oh he tried to hit him with the stanky leg, Tekken 4. Fight. 
And that, that only works against West Coast. Yeah. And only if you're Avery. <laughs> for uh, some yeah. reason. <laughs> oh, man. Avery has lost a big match with that dumb shit on your skill players. <laughs> I mean, same thing with Bitch, eh? <laughs> <laughs> Nice. Oh, there's a parry! Yeah, you saw the parry come out a little earlier now from Vinche, so he's willing to throw it out there. Oh. Alright, Vinche now. Being a great character already, like, that parry is just the juice, man. Hey. It's so Ooh, just a little too late with the parry? Yeah, it looked like a little too late there. Man, was, but yeah, that was he made the right read too. He tried to punch Barry. Binchang did throw out a punch, but just not at the right time. And got yeah. the count it for the, you know what? Honestly, that's something Binchang dropping everything. Yeah. Jesus, he yeah. got no damage out of that. He got he made he got more damage out of the down two than the combo. <laughs> wow. Again. Step. And now this whack combo. Hey, it's Super better than safe. nothing. Safe wow. Combo. Actually, don't even know if there's a better combo to be honest. Yeah, from that axis, I'm not sure. Oh, okay, like Binchang, coming okay. back here. I'm starting to notice two things Bin Chang's doing a little bit more, which is the parry and the, the, the standing four is definitely something he needs to start Ooh. throwing out more. But damn, it's taking five. I love out. that shit. Fake players right. don't use that enough, man. I um, know, I still use it. It's yeah. still great. Oh god, he's still doing it. He's it's stopping. Good. Delayable wall Oh, it worked too. He had the counter. Oh. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. 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 There it is. The first. I feel like oh. the first Bin Chang's hit. I, I don't think I don't think Jin's all that stupid. <laughs> oh, oh god! god. Bam, Are you sure is. he just did three safe mid wall bounces in a row? He's pretty stupid. And then he got one. Cool. <laughs> yeah, but I mean, but Joey was Ooh. doing forward two one. He's just kept doing this this. You know, he's just like. <laughs> yeah, I feel like Joey just decided to start trolling Ben Chang. He says like, I'm gonna mess with him a little bit, like, ha, ha, ha. and then he got hit with the down to one. Like, oh no, <laughs> my hubris, dude. Like two weeks ago, like even three weeks ago at Bud, like Bin, like Bin Chang lost to Joey Fury, and he went into he he teabagged him, went back turn manually, and then he like crouched back turn for like half a second, and then he swept him from oh, back turn yeah. to take it. And then the week after that, he destroyed the shit out of Bin Chang again, three zero in grand finals, and he was just playing with him the whole time. Teabagging him, key charging him, like what? doing the regular get crunk taunt on him and stuff. He was joining him all of it. I was like, bro, what did Ben Chang do to Joey that's <laughs> making Joey Fury like this? I've never ben seen. Ben Chang was beating him for a while, right? He was, yeah. And then Joey started winning for a yeah. while. And now it's kind of like flip flopping again. That's this why it's cool sick. to watch them. Yeah. This is they're... super fun. Yeah. You never know who's going to come out on that specific day. I don't know. The. I, I, the just recently, you know, I, I, hearing all the the the, the in-game trash talking with the teabagging and all that is giving me Conor McGregor vibes, man. Joey, just don't throw any kicks. No low kick, please. <laughs> Save your legs. <laughs> Bitch Egg is being too too kind. You know, he's not going to fight back like that. <laughs> all right. Well, here we go. Two to one. Joey in the lead. Uh, Dragon's Nest. Okay. Originally awesome. Fang it. stage, right? Yeah. Yeah, and keeping it with the wall stage too. I guess Joey wants would rather run it with the wall here. I guess it makes sense too. Fang with the wall is so strong. Oh my god, right off the bat. Hey, hey. that's a good move. Hey. Oh, ducked it though, but didn't get a great punish. Oh, he baited the back one, but wasn't ready. To oh, oh my god, this fish all day for it. Why not? It's Why not? safe mid wall bounce. Who needs four four two when you got down one? Four mm. four safe counter two nice. <laughs> Ooh, hey. They both have the four two. <laughs> mm -hmm. Things is a little better though. Has a bigger side step. Ooh. Man, both these guys whipping the same move. <laughs> there we go. Right kick. No. Still hit. Still got a hit. Wasn't sure if he could carry it to the wall. I think the he back two one. The wall. He could have had the wall if he didn't do the back two one. Back threes and one. Ah, three. yeah, yeah, that's right. Well, as soon as he did back two one, the combo was dead. He was not gonna yeah. hit the wall. Mm -hmm. He gave up the wall combo as soon as that. Bin Chang stopped playing Jin Mishima. I think that's what happened compared yeah. to the final. Now he's trying to play Jin Kazama. Exactly. Yeah. He used to play Jin Mishima. 
Well, no, I, don't, I think he tried doing that in the first game. I think that's where Joey yeah. was getting a lot of success. That's the reason why he has to play Jin Kazama now. Because Joey switched it up. He, he just started playing super patient. Two seconds. Joey doing strings. Mm. I mean, yeah. Bitch Mark. doing strings to burn two well, seconds out. Super smart. Fight. He could have even done the five hit Kazama combo without the, four, the, uh, the low hit at the end. <laughs> 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 yeah. That's such a good, like, two second time wasted. What's that move in Smash oh! for, for, uh, for Kazuya? Does it Kazuya back have taunt. <laughs> back taunt? It, it really is back taunt for Kazuya in that game. <laughs> get a full string after hitting just two buttons. So wow, again, there it is again. The sidestep, gonna get the wall. Nice. Hey. Oh my god. Big damage to. What the? He's too early. No duck there, but Joey trying to get the throw. Bin Chang swinging, and now it's tied up 2 2. Yeah. Bin Chang coming back now. You know, it looked yeah. bad at the beginning, but now it's tied up 2 2. So that means we're going to go to one more game. Winner of this, either if Bin Chang, the tournament's over, or if it's Joey, we reset and watch it all again. I don't want yeah. to see the run back. I just want to see more matches between these two. <laughs> the Jin is looking. I mean, honestly, I'm, I'm like, the, the, the mind games between these two is, is pretty crazy. You know, I don't know how to, how, how to feel about it because. When the when the the match started as like you know probably what Marduk versus Falcon Rom it devolved all the way down to Jin versus, <laughs> versus Fang. Fang yeah like where did how far have we, we started here and then yeah. we got here yeah. and if you weren't there for the middle it's gonna be real confusing for yeah you. Like, if you haven't watched like, Tekken in like yeah, six yeah, months what? I'm sure looks looks real confusing for you right now <laughs> yeah but where's like, Leroy where's Falcon <laughs> Rom it's like child come here I have a story for you. It's like, <laughs> Yes, too. These guys have been through a lot. I mean, they. Pl I mean, that's the reason why, like you guys said, the, you know, all all these online tournaments. These two are pretty much like the most consistent online players in terms of the amount of tournaments they answer and how far they get, right? And they're, they're pretty consistent in the fact that they'll play each other in these tournaments because no one's beating them normally, right? Yeah, so. these these are two of the guys that I feel like have defined what the meta is in North America in terms of tournaments. People come in and make a ruckus every so often. Like Cuddlecore comes in and beats everybody. Mm -hmm. Glaciating showed up for a while and beat everybody with Miguel and Paul. It feels like it always comes down to these two guys. Staples, yeah, the real staples. These guys have been grinding, really putting in the work, and the efforts have been paying off, as you guys can see here. Wow, Ooh. got the counter hit on there. All right, so infinite stage here. Joey opting to go with no walls this time. Didn't like the walls in that last game. Love that Joey gets all his confirms, too. Like, every little hit, one three counter hit, get the shoulder. One plus two, didn't get the punch fairy, still get the mini combo shoulder. There's no way Binche makes this comeback, right? No. Not predictions. I don't know. I oh, don't know. Predictions. I don't know. Predictions of what? Last game? You oh, wait, I forgot. The set's not over. Damn. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> oh, you <laughs> Did I? Yeah, what, what, what did I do? Only a true master. What did I do? <laughs> How did I do that? I don't know. How do you guys think I beat Magnificent earlier? <laughs> Yeah, just, just Where's talking. the script? <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. You know one thing though? Binchang's not a Jin player. The only reason why I know that is because he hasn't hit a single like counter hit forward four. Oh yeah. He traded on one, but yeah. <laughs> he hasn't hit a single one. It's like, what kind of Jin player are you? It's like a Steve with no back one. Yeah, for <laughs> Ooh, nice step there from Joey. Yeah, perfect step. Ooh, hey. ooh he knows Bin Chang's on, uh, he has electric on the mind. <laughs> he knew that Bin Chang just was looking for an electric, any electric to clip him. Man, that was nice too. The, the... <laughs> Why does he keep doing that combo? That combo sucks. <laughs> He's not a gym player, man. Calm down. But he was He's doing the right man. combo earlier. That's what I'm saying. Slightly off axis, wasn't it? Sometimes you just, in the heat of the moment, you forget what character you're playing. Yeah, in the heat of the moment, you've got to speak. That shit was crazy. In the heat of the moment, the thing is something happens. Yeah, that was definitely like a rip <laughs> sentence. <laughs> at rip speed. <laughs> yeah, it really was my speed. Oh, oh there we go. God. There we go. Finally got that. Jin combo down four. Damn. All right, Ben Chang one round away from sending everyone home. Jin so good. I'm gonna start playing Jin. Fuck it. I'm gonna save this for a minute. Good. You oh do that. my god. You do that. I'll be the Steve player. All right. All right. I'll be the Marta player. Hey, that'd be sick. <laughs> Sugit still left with lane. You can't switch. You stole the lane. <laughs> Sugit stole the lane. We have to make a new shirt. <laughs> <laughs> 
<laughs> Damn. Oh. Yo! Fighting? Final, nice! Final round. Final Tournament round. point Bing Chang, reset point Fight. Joey Fury. This is crazy. This is crazy. Ooh. Look out for one forward, spin into the forward for the classic. Yep, such a active <laughs> sequence. <laughs> <laughs> I like that. I like the phrasing. <laughs> oh, I think that was an LRK. I mean, he could have tried to. Been. He, he ducked and he could have might, might have gone for like the uh, wall standing two. Man, Ben Shang points. Ben Shang just put up the wall for this final round. Yeah, yeah he did. Joey can't get in. Wow. <laughs> More down twos. I mean, but the thing is that this is going to be 20 seconds. Yeah, the sights of fours might be coming out. Joey's back in it now. And it He's just outside sure of range, it though. One, oh, God, Ooh, it, wasn't it was an electric. That was an electric bitch. Oh! Oh, oh, time! seconds? Oh, oh, the string! Oh, the stupid string, God! <laughs> I feel like... I feel, like he had a, I feel like he had a 100% success rate over the course of both sets with that string. Yeah, oh definitely. My one down God. three, and also down forward one four. Joey never ducked a single one either. He, ben Chang is the champion. I mean, the, he ducked like one, and he still didn't even get that much damage from it, right? So I don't think at the point, by that point, he's like, it's worth it because he didn't want to risk getting hit by clip by the mid or something. Yeah. But damn, nice job, Ben Chang, closing out the Jin matchup of all characters. Delay on that string, man. Like, he delayed the second hit, and then he delayed the third hit. I was like, what? I didn't even know he could do that like that. That was crazy. Yeah, I thought I thought Joey was gonna block it for sure, but to be mm -hmm. honest, I was like, I'm not sure Ben Chang's gonna do it though, right? I was like, yeah, Joey's exactly. Gonna, yeah, Joey's gonna block it, but Ben Chang, I don't know if he's gonna do it. And that was, was the was extra swapped. layer right there. Yeah, I was like, who even finishes that string? But then it hit anyway, so Ben Chang was like, and I could delay the last idiot a little bit more just to throw you off, and it worked. Mm -hmm. Yeah, I mean, dude, that was amazing. Ben Chang, first place tonight. Joey Fury, second place. Third place, Jay Buckley. Huge shot to Jay Buckley this Woo week, you know, putting in work, switching characters, bringing out that Bob. Uh, fourth place, whoever, doesn't matter. Fifth <laughs> place, seventh place, congratulations, everybody. Uh, it's, it was a fun one this week. It was definitely wild brackets, right? Uh, and that's how it usually is out here. Like, you never know who's going to make it into these top eight. We had Junior and Shadow and PDX and Joe Crush all in this tournament, yep. you know? They all the lost top in eight. pools. Wow, Ben yeah. Chang said it's his first win ever since season two in ICFC. Wow, wow. congratulations, Congrats. Yeah. Damn, it's I been a minute. It. Ben Chang, back at it first <laughs> Good place. Good to see. Good to see. The Jin right, so Kazama, that's all I needed, man. He's needing a real stupid character, you know? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, the hate for Jin was so strong today. Oh. And Jin wins it all. That's the, that's the theme of the day. The Jin is stupid. <laughs> <laughs> Pretty good. Without a doubt, man. That was, it was a lot of fun. But I think that's going to do it for us here. Thank you for joining us today. This week, Bloodhawk. We got MYK, Rick Stub. Make sure you guys follow everybody on Twitter. Uh, I'm sure everyone has probably an Instagram or a TikTok or something, too. Go check those things out. Uh, but that does do it for this week. Make sure you guys come on back next week. It'll be week five. We'll catch you guys next time. Have a good one. Peace. Yos. Later. Peace.